I'm supposed to be. There we go. Okay, cool. Looks like the guy's on the request board. I'd be pretty sure. I'm, what should I do? Confront. Hey, you all need to quiet down. I'll go. Huh? What's that? Just something to say? You can address me as Terabosama. We're trying to enjoy ourselves here. What's wrong with that? Customers are complaining. Oh yeah? So what? Hey, anybody can be a problem. Let them try to stop us. We're Jozo. Tengu. Hey shopkeep, did you hire this do-gooder? When we kick his ass, you better remember uh, that's what's in store for you. Hey. Try this again. Hey. I'll take you on. Come with me. You really piss me off. On your feet, boys. You got a beating to hand out. Excited. I don't think I've popped this many dudes at once before. I'll look for any Tengu hanging around. Let's make sure everyone sees uh, uh, what we do to guys like this. Yes, sir. Let's get him. Enough dudes. Next time, come back with more. <laughs> Which am I making a day, anyways? Hi, you doll face. 124,000. Jeez. Can I sell my coke yet? It's still negative 40%. I honestly feel like if I beat him up, it'll finish the rest of it. So I really should just eat his ass real quick. Then at least. How are you going to be sad? You want every day for weeks. I win two days in a row. And it... <laughs> Just this give me this. <laughs> Let me have it. Yellow's crew? Nothing an ice pick can't handle. I bet you if I beat what's left of Yellow, it'll stop uh, undercutting. You should be, goddammit. Put We will do. I was just so busy looking forward, I didn't even see those guys on the right. Yep. Grenade! Slow walk this way. <laughs> no grenades for me. Here comes our cat. Last chance to fight like hell. Alright, where are they? <laughs> Flashbangs don't affect them. Flashbangs don't affect them. Domination! The 
Maybe to check the other two. Swear I was shooting them, but apparently not. All right, so that's all but the mobsters who I've had no Run issues with. I almost want to let them live. <laughs> Rocket's gonna know our name now. That level ninety guy that came yeah, in last week talking he all that shit. Town. Yeah, the wannabe that, that will never be. Uh huh. So yes, LT. Time to oh, step so it up. Baker time. Ah, oh, it's like as I keep taking out other gangs. Fucking Sheriff Norris is like, we're gonna fuck him up. Stop trying to fuck me up. Oh, his last standing shed, <laughs> Detective Rico. I was just gonna. Shit. Skipped all of that. <laughs> Can you handle them all coming at you at once? Alright. Not to blame everyone here. Is there in a sweat? Don't worry. Each one will fight a single shot. Some of them are loaded, some of them aren't. I reckon you make the ones that are packing your first target. Most important thing, so many hits yourself. I, I blow the whistle. I want fleet feet, how you may not brute strength. Right. About avoiding fire and taking down enemies efficiently. Well said. The trial ends in 30 men down. Are you ready? I'll you. Alrighty, as much as I wasn't really ready for that. Also, there you go. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Motherfuckers! <laughs> Great. <laughs> Showed you what for. Should have watched Equilibrium. <laughs> Essence of the three-legged mare has been. Up. Where do I go now? Yes. Jumping shit last one. I mean, I got a helicopter. I can go wherever I want. No! Ah. Oh. That's some bull crap. Headshot. Makes him sound like he's thick. Oh, who the fuck was that? Wakey, wakey, eggs and fuck. <laughs> oh, you're so cute. Look at them trying so hard. Oh, 
We're like a well-oiled machine. Of course, I don't know where you went during the beginning of that, but whatever. <laughs> Death is a preferable alternative to communism. Yeah, death before communism. Didn't mean to talk to you. Let me finish killing the rest of you guys. Man, this water is super radioactive. Finally, an enemy that wears power armor for once. I've been wanting this for so long. Come on, pussy. Shoot me. Oh, you fucking died. Weak ass. I feel like half these people are dying because I breathed on them wrong. Five millimeter rounds. So very funny. All right, did we kill them all yet? We still left standing. <laughs> oh, those chunks went everywhere. <laughs> Embrace democracy, or you will be eradicated. Pipe rifles. Go away. It's raining, man. <laughs> yeah. Pretty much. All right. Let's see what level one. I just thought it was another dude just started beating his ass, and I realized that he had a name. Notice three Lev, uh, Surge, and Fisher. Fisher was the one in power where I beat the shit out of like three, four times and then he died. He never even got a shot off. It was kind of sad. Ah, so, 
the vault cockroach does makes dirty work, though, huh? I can tell you're afraid. Maybe answer some questions and I'll spare you. You move back. This is fucking awkward. Looks like you're stuck ah. on deck. Alright, strength eight. You're going to answer my questions and maybe I won't kill you. I'm quicker on the draw than you. I'm quicker on the draw and you can't run from me. So tell me what I want to know. Agility eight. Endurance. Answer my questions. I'll wait here all day. Yeah, it takes a lot of endurance, doesn't it? I'm gonna kill him, so. Oh? Strength eight. You think you intimidate me with big muscles and idle threats? Go. Let me see if you can form coherent question. <laughs> Are you calling me stupid just because I'm strong? It's called going to the gym, weirdo. <laughs> what do you want a new tombstone? <laughs> uh, you're right, I'm done with questions. Gonna do this the easy way or the hard way. Give me a reason I shouldn't kill you. Why didn't you break into Vault 79 yourself? Vault is waste of time. I hear talk of gold. Gold is useless. Real value comes from guns, food, ammo, information. I get better offer to ruin your plan. Okay, so who offered you? Alright. I'm here. I went out to go grab a snack real quick right at the end. I completely forgot to uh, hurry it up because <laughs> I ended up talking to my mom and my sister. Um, anyways. How's everyone doing? All right, we're gonna do more cyberpunk today. Which, speaking of, to answer real quick. All right, we're good. All right, never mind. Anyways, cyberpunk, yeah. <laughs> we're gonna do some cyberpunk. Um, sorry, I'm getting so distracted. Like, my brain is just not here today. <sighs> All right, let's get rolling. Let's get over to gaming. Since like last night, I've been rocking these hiccups. I'm sick of it. <laughs> Keyboard working? <laughs> Gotta wait till we're in game, hello. I guess. I'm Eric Bob, and you're watching W. Oh, yeah, now it's working. What the heck? <laughs> Undercover cop. <laughs> This is the place. Tick, 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 tick. Now we wait for the big man. There he is in his crappy truck. That's one of the boys from Twilight. Hey, V. What's up, bro? How you holding up? Been better. I know. Probably not hard to tell. Nice ride. Nice ride. Always. Brand new? Nope. Not in a chatty mood, I see. Not really. Sorry. Yeah, so what's the issue? So, what happened? Needed someone to talk to. Mm-hmm. 
First, take a look. Hello, my name is Arif Iqbal, and this is WNS News. Today's story. More dead politicians? Just watch it. Oh wait, these kids with the kidnapping. Yeah, I saw the news like four times. Copy that. Out of the car. Hands up. Easy, officer. Relax. Shut your mouth. Oh shit. Uh, we have a 1053 and a 1054. I repeat, a 1053 and a 1054. from the footage is LeVar Martinez, age 17. His parents reported his disappearance over a month ago. Unfortunately, LeVar's life could not be saved. His body could not withstand the severe septic shock he suffered. Autopsy reports reveal the teenager was given dangerously high levels of hormones, anabolic steroids, and stimulants. The possessions and genetic material of seven other missing teens were also found in the car. Okay. Unfortunately, their fates remain unknown. Although the criminal widely known as Peter Pan survived the gunshot, he has not regained consciousness, making interrogation impossible. Please stay tuned to WNS. So this Peter Pan case of yours? Peter Pan? He an old case? You were looking for him? Never heard of him. Didn't cross my desk. Okay, so what's the point? What's the problem if they caught the guy? My nephew. Randy disappeared not long past from what you just saw. Gotcha. The kid was wearing Randy's shoes. Oh, Jesus. So, uh, tell me Randy's more. disappearance. Know anything else? My sister and I don't get along that well. Uh, I don't know much. Just wish I could have been there for her when she needed it most. And been assigned to what, they figured you'd get emotional and kept you off the case? More like a restraining order. Won't let me anywhere near it. Gonagal took the lead on it. Lazy ass gonk. And so far, he ain't accomplished shit. Okay. I wouldn't let No it way go. I'd let this lie. I know. And that's why I'm asking for your help. So what do we need to do? Can't interrogate the guy because he's a veg, but we can view his dreams. Sorry, dreams? You heard me. Come on, I'll explain on the way. It's an experimental procedure, but it's already yielding results. They record dreams that can be played back as PDs. Got access to these dreams? Not yet, but they keep them in the lab we're headed to now. Ooh, we're jaywalking. <laughs> I wonder if he wears real leather. Yeah, and again, we're walking where we're not supposed to. <laughs> okay. Got an appointment? Not exactly. We'll go in together, but, uh... Not through the main entrance. Oh, we're gonna break the law. We'll find a different way in, and then hustle out quick. Never actually been here, so I'll need your help. All right. <laughs> See you, dork. Get in my way of finding the arcade. Great. What now? 
we find our entrance. They have an audit today. Should be a ghost town. No need to be quiet. How'd you know about the audit? I did my homework. There's any other floors with interesting stuff? Before I commit. Alright. Guess not. Know where they're keeping the BD? Likely the room where they edit the autistic kids' dreams. Should be labeled as Anthony Harris. Oh my god. I didn't even realize when I was first scanning it. A few of these rooms we probably don't have to bother Classic with. Metal device simulates conditions in the uterus maintains the life of the BB. Yeah, and it detects VTs. <laughs> we love you, BB. Always good to see you. you. Keep up the hard work, little guy. So we've seen him in the game. Locked. Can't himself. get in. And now we've seen uh, his death training reference. That's cool. Nothing here. No sign of any BDs. A novel phobia. Fear of the number 91. In recent years, the list of commonly feared numbers such as 4, 13, and 66 has grown now to officially include the number 91. While the phobias of other numbers have origins well studied by science, tetraphobia derives from the fact that the Chinese word for death and they four sounds store similar. Any BDs in this area. We can still only hypothesize about the rise of 91. Patients afflicted by the phobia the number 91 often complain of recurring nightmares in which a giant countdown reaches 91 then suddenly stops when they attempt to restart the countdown it transforms into a bright yellow board with vermin crawling all over it this shard this shared experience has already spawned unproven conspiracy theories which among other things claim that the dreams are transmitted via Either electromagnetic waves, the digitization nice of minds, of a mysterious netrunner sect, rogue artificial intelligences, or classified nanochips installed in Nightcorp agents. None of these outlandish ideas contain a grain of truth, of course. So, what is the causes? Uh, what is it that causes the phobia to ma manifest itself? Sorry, manifests such an intense reaction. That much yet remains unknown. Empty but brain dance at, case. Um, but as so many scientists often claim, the truth is out there. So without full knowledge of the phobia's origin and its underlying factors, how can you treat it? Studies thus far have shown uh, promising results for conditioning patients via induced dream states in which the number 91 is inverted to the number 19. Although this method remains clinical trials, experts op optimistic uh, the 91% sex success rate will only continue to improve. 91%. <laughs> it's funny. All right. Yeah, I keep forgetting it's not that. Damn it. Messages. Security update. I would like to remind everyone of the upcoming audit and changes in the security. I'm willing to answer any immediate questions you might have. As you're aware, we've had complaints from the NCPD, I know, I know, but we will have to follow the new guidelines. There's no wiggle room on this. At the time, to be determined later, you will all get your new double verification access signatures. You will each receive individual emails with the relevant details. 
No more of that reply all funny business. Until then, continue your work as normal. Of course, excluding the day we have assigned for the audit. Have a nice day, security. Small step for science, a giant leap for humankind. Good morning, all. I would like to congratulate our very own Dr. Yawen Packard on the recent stride she made in the field of pediatric autism therapy. Her invaluable work has paved the way for more effective therapy applications than the established behavioral methods. Teach, S ESDM, and RDI clearly surpassing all supportive methods. Example, sensory integration and substantially, substantially building upon traditional approaches uh, such as music therapy. I speak for all of us when I say we are extremely proud of Dr. Packard's scientific achievements, but also more importantly, proud to see the huge inflow of warm letters from happy parents. Keep up the great work, everyone. Eugene Kuzma. Meditation work. Hard news. Heard the news. I just saw the email. I'm sorry to hear they cut your project. If it's any consolation, I've tried to apply your methods to my personal time, and I feel like my creativity is on a whole other level. Seriously. I really hope this is just temporary and the... I guess that's what I'll say. They reinstate the project. Though, I've got bad feelings uh, since Dr. Lynch's departure. There just hasn't been the same support. Hang in there, Caroline. Don't lose hope. Important. All staff, please read. Dear team, I like to be, I like to beat around the butch as much as the next guy, but I'm afraid I don't have that luxury this time. First off, you all remember that framed, guessing it meant famed quote, I used to, oh yeah, framed, okay, quote I used to have in my office, never trust a person who's never tried to steal, well, seems someone took, took that sentiment to heart, now don't panic, it wasn't the quote that was stolen, it's safety, safely at home, rather it appears a staff member has taken our neurotransmitter research files from the facility with the likely intent of selling them to third party. As such, all lab employees will be required to take a polygraph before leaving the facility led by our own Dr. Al Tolliver. If AI finds anything troubling from your tests, uh, the next course of action would be termination, legal action, or both. No jokes. I mean this in all seriousness. Let me emphasize, do the polygraph before leaving work, then you're free to get uh, get your naps, showers, lap dances, or whatever it is you people do in your off hours. Have a pleasant day, Sai. This week's audit. Dear all, as many of you know, this week's audit is simply a formality. We are required by law to periodically evaluate current laboratory safeguards uh, for effectiveness and future modernization efforts. Remember that this audit is as uh, beneficial for you, or sorry, for the city uh, bookkeeping as it is to keep you and your research safe. We're all playing on the same team, for the same team here. Please just treat this as a mandatory day off. Best regards, and as fart fasting, city auditor. All right, I feel like really up today. that's a little better it's like my seat had my like thighs like shoved into the metal bar that's at the top of the desk No, no, no. Lol. And just remember not to mention our la latest study to those NCP 
NYPD slug brains because they, well, they just wouldn't understand anyways. Security update. Come on. Yeah, all right, we already read that one. We read that one. We read that one. Project dec decisions for the next quarter. Important. Following projects have been green lighted to continue next quarter. Neurotransmitters and selective countermeasures in combating the effects of stress. Cyberpsychosis. Audiovisual stimulation and autism therapy. Limited environmental simulation stimulation as treatment for antisocial behavior. We decided to spend research into transcendental meditation. All those involved on the project will soon receive a more detailed report about the indefinite suspension and information regarding the new project allocations. Outer space, my life in orbit. What's life in space like? Comfortable. Of course, not everything is. Everything's a bed of roses. Gravity below one, one g isn't great for your bones and muscles. Synthesized food isn't to die for, and stuff from Earth is a rare, is as rare as it is expensive. If you live in a private orbital station, congrats, you're richer than me. You always see the same faces, but if you live in a hybrid station uh, like Crystal Palace, you'll have to live with corpor corpo rat bachelor parties every weekend, but don't let that put you off. There are more upsides than downsides to living in orbit. First of all, safety. To get into orbit, you need a lot of zeros in your bank account which means you won't see uh, legions of homeless people, skizzed out gangsters, or aggressive joy toys, the exception to that being the lunar colonies, but no self-respecting orbital dweller would ever set foot there. In other words, you can walk outside at night unarmed, without security, and come back home in one piece, while it undisturbed, amazing, right? Secondly, quality of service. Anyone in the customer service sector had to rack up an enormous debt to come up here. Their only hope is to pay it off within their lifetime is to rake in a, sorry, rake in a lot, and I mean a lot of tips, which means they'll bend over backwards to satisfy your every whim. If you're an employer, uh, you don't have to worry that an employee you just hired and trained at your expense We'll suddenly quit and go for work with the competition. For a few extra eddies a week, many stations, uh, especially the private ones, simply don't have competition. And if they do, it's basically negligible. Agreements can be made so situations like that don't occur. Thirdly, and most importantly, no government can tell you what to do, where and how, Orbital stations are autonomous and governed by their own laws, and there aren't that many of them. Uh, if you can't afford your own station, you're the undisputed lord and master of your little corner of space. You want to tie the help up <laughs> to, the, to a whipping post? When they make a mistake, go right ahead. Want five wives and four husbands? I'm sure you'll have a line of willing volunteers. Man, I, I feel like I would, uh, if I was able to get up there, I would uh, just invite my friends to <laughs> come live with me. Or else, like, I feel like I'd get bored. 
How to prepare for an audit. <laughs> Brain dance conditioning and cyber psychosis. Come on. Cyber psychosis treatment. Why do you need such a long title report? Study that use studies that use brain imaging methodologies have shown a progressive reduction in brain volume, but a swelling of the ventric ventric. Uh, system and the volume of cere cerebrospinal fluid produced in people who suffer from cyber, cyber so nah I'll have a drink with me wait yeah I do suffering from uh, cyber psychosis other studies have found differences in the degree of cortical nerve uh, cell depletion between stage one cyberpsychosis patients treated pharmaceutically and those who receive brain dance conditioning. Increased loss of cortical nerve cells was detected in those using pharmaceutical treatment, from which it has been concluded that brain dance conditioning has a neuroprotective effect. This experiment's results should be taken into account when implementing brain dance conditioning methods in locations with minimal environmental stimulation present. Novel phobia, fear of number 91. Oh yeah, we already read that. Small step for size, giant leap for humankind. I swear, there's like a hair inside my right cup and it keeps tickling my ear. I got no idea how I got in there. Alright, so we already read that one. Read that one. Melissa Rory, ra latest research. I need to, like stretch my mouth or something. Ah. It's like I can't get my mouth around some of these words. So just <laughs> Anyways, based on the latest research on the subject, it appears to it appears the patient suffers from relapses of antisocial behaviors. The recommended treatment approach is limited environmental simu sim stimulation and increased doses of neuroleptics. See treatment details in the attachment. I remind you, this is not an isolated case, but a fairly common problem among members of MaxTAC. The NCPD is pushing for more resources to put into cyberpsychosis research, but our facility simply can't accommodate an uptick right now. And a friendly reminder, please email your applications for overtime next quarter by no later than tomorrow, EOD. This week's audit. Uh, yeah, we already read this. Cabinet, trail spilled whiskey, close to zero percent. Brain dance. <laughs> Brain dance treatment for pediatric autism introduction. Activity in a developing uh, brain is higher compared to that in a mature brain. This greater capacity to establish neural connections and reorganize cortical and subcortical brain structures allows for substantial compensating abilities, um, even in circumstances of extensive brain damage. Unfortunately, in the case of a of children on the autism spectrum, the problem is one of hyperactivity, 
An overabundance of firing synapses results in synaptic communication disorders. This study compared children on the autistic spectrum who did not receive any preventative measures with those who received early yeah, early brain dance therapy. Initial findings suggest the brain dance uh, treatment provides beneficial support for synaptic function. Please refer to subsequent reports for detailed summaries of the findings. Security update. Da -da. Oh, that around the corner. I don't think we saw this one yet. <sighs> What's up, Choomster? You know about the audit in your lab is coming up, right? Maybe get those invoices for Wu all squared away, huh? Don't you got enough on your own of your own paperwork to push around? Leave the invoices for Wu to me. I'll make sure our little piggies don't go hungry. You read Kuzma's email congratulating Ewan. Eugene must have been very ahem, pleased with her strides. I'm not surprised. I mean, she cozies up with that cop, uh, then all of a sudden gets an NCPD contract. What a coinky dink, huh? Exactly. Oh, yeah, okay. You already read that one. feels creepy. Ah, so if I could touch it. Wait, what does it say? Creatine monohydrate. Maximum performance. Take the guesswork out of the calorie intake. You know, sometimes I think about that. If I could just supplement my whole life, I would. <laughs> just like nothing but protein shakes and vitamins. And, uh, you know, when I want flavor, eat an actual meal. Like one meal a day that's like really good. Fear of number 91, security update, small step. Most Rory, latest research. Yeah, it's about the antisocial kids. Next quarter, we saw it. Small staff. Yep. And yep. Alright, so we already read all of that. Symbols and dreams, electric sheep, and unicorns. 10 to 20 percent. Alright, so nothing left to do other than go do the thing. Hey, River! Think I got it! Found something? Not yet. Anthony Harris, let's try these drawers. Breaking in State River, state. why not just have a janitor crack a door for you? Can't risk getting scolded for sniffing around somebody else's River. case. Yo, a... and what are you doing here? You got kicked off the force. Just suspended, actually. Are you? And who might you be? I'm calling the actual police. Oh, wait, wait, wait here. Hear me out, please. Seriously, River? You weren't in enough trouble already? 
Harris kidnapped my nephew. I'm sorry. Really, I am. Well, she like but we store from... evidence here, Dangerous. and we have strict protocols. We're talking about saving protocols. Kid. Talking about his nephew's life here. A child's life. This is an ongoing police investigation. Go, please. Can't leave without Peter Get Pan's Get out girls. now! Can't leave without Peter Pan's dreams. I'll say it one last time. Out! Damn it, Yawan. Who the fuck do you think you are? Remember your first med school exam? You know the one. Passed it with flying colors. Gotta remember it. Ladies' room erupted in flame. They evacuated everybody for two hours. I cannot believe you would throw that in my face. Yeah, that is kind I of I never wish breath. to see you here again. Especially you. This man, he only takes. He never gives anything back. Barely, Barely know, no, River. We just work together. Do not believe any promise he makes. Good tip. Thanks. But we're wasting time. Harris is dream beating. Where is it? He isn't dreaming. What? Why? He's too brain dead. A bullet damaged his cerebral cortex. We get only dissonant urges. Pieces. I'd like to try audiovisual stimulation. But he isn't on the spectrum. A favorite song or movie helps you reach the kids. Might be worth a try. I am aware of the similarity. Hypothalamus stimulation and hormone production. But Harris is not a child. I have never tried the procedure on an adult. Subject AH. Patient transported to hospital 18 minutes after severing missile wound to the head. Alright, missile wound is uh, very British. They're called bullets. <laughs> As the missile penetrated uh, multiple brain layers, a temporary pulse cavity uh, immediately followed. So, uh, yeah, weird British people say things like a catapult instead of a crossbow. You know, they got weird words for everything. Torch instead of flashlight. You know, what is this? 1700s? 1500s? 1300s even? Disgusting. <laughs> Due to rapid intervention, into cranial pressure was reduced and inflammatory damage to the brain tissue was avoided. Despite successful intervention, the patient remains in the coma with estimated chances of waking at only 0.6%. In the event the patient does wake up, uh, likely complications may include paresis and the right side of the body, vision impairment, speech impairment, cognitive disorders. Estimated value for NCPD uh, investigation near zero. Security update, small steps. <sighs> Next quarter is bullcrap, all staff, and we saw it. All right, yeah, we already saw that. Any specific reason why? Any reason you haven't? Because unlike River, I went to med school and studied neuroscience. And not by reading about it over someone's shoulder on the metro. Let's Friend. try it. We don't even know his preferences. I'll find something. Does that mean you're willing to try? Just go. I'll open the front door for you. Let's ride, V. I know exactly where to start. Say, by the way, what do you know about biochips? Arasaka's relic in particular. Well, it's designed to store a person's neural engram. Uh, sorry. Just imagine copying over a person's memories and personality. Right, part. I get that. I'm more curious what happens if the stored engram overwrites the engrams of the chip carrier. Overwrites? I... I'm not even sure that's possible. Why do you ask? Nah, never mind. Never mind. Not a big yeah. deal. Thanks. Bye. It's nice not really knowing you. Cops seem to like you. Could be this one sniffing around for something extra. River's alright. No, River's alright. Mm, yeah. 
Can tell you got something to say, so say it. Me? No, no. Just maybe this cop's flying straight in your pants. Quite an observation on human behavior coming from a fucking stack of data in my head. That could be mean to Johnny. <laughs> what about that? Alright. I think he's being up and up for now, at least. Plus, we already got Judy. What do we need him for? Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Let me hear it. Don't tell me you got fired. Lost your badge. Didn't tell me about it. Why? I don't know. Makes you a bit of a lead head, doesn't it? Yeah, that it do. It's just, uh, it's not easy for me to talk about what's biting at my ass. Fair gotcha. enough. Could tell me where we're headed, though. To Joss's. Randy's mom. She thinks he just ran away from home. For now, keep the kidnapping between us. Shouldn't we be looking for Harris's place? Tell me more about Tell Randy. Tell me about Randy. What kind of kid he is. Petty theft, drugs, running away from home. That kind. Cop uncles really see the best in you. There are people who always find their way into trouble. Randy's one of them. Haven't mentioned Randy's dad. Where's Randy's dad? Been a few years since he got popped. Gang war. Huh. Great role model. Josh was left alone with three. <laughs> but she's as tough as weathered leather. Okay. Shouldn't we be looking for Harris's place? Gonna though? tell me why we aren't trying to find Harris's apartment? Well, it's a house. And I doubt he's keeping his victims in his basement. And besides, we are trying. Want to see if we can find some connection to Harris at Randy's. Pretty weak lead. Makes sense. Best we can hope for just now. Yeah, we're not gonna report you. Not worried Yawin's gonna toe the line. Rat you out to her superiors. Used to be friends. Doubt she'd do that. Plus, not that I'd use it, but I do know one skeleton she'd prefer remain tucked in her closet. It's just mean. I think Yawin will actually well, help us. All things considered. Yeah. These tiffs of ours always end up the same way. I'll tell you about it over a beer sometime. Uh, let's focus on finding Really out of focus on finding Randy now. Of course. No flirtation without representation. <laughs> God, why do these people drive 30 everywhere they go? I'm not saying they need to drive like me, but, you know, have a little bit of pep in their step when it comes to the, the gas pedal. Oh, I've been over here. That's when I crashed my way down the canyon. Or jumped down. I forget. Trailer park tracks. is it sure been a while he used to come over every weekend a long time ago and changed, changed it all since places like this never change lovely neighborhood Mwah. thanks ben 
Hey, you're actually still chilling. Oh, okay. Not gonna knock. River. You either got business with me or news about my Randy. Wouldn't drag your butt out here if you didn't. Greetings from depression. I was 15 years old, set to fail for my classes at school, but I could barely get out of my bed, much less drag myself to the bathroom and take a shower. At first, my parents were worried, treating me gently. But after a few weeks, their patience began to run out, and that's when it started. Snap out of it. Just go for a run. You'll feel better. Why don't you talk to your friends? Quit feeling sorry for yourself. Uh, what do you have to be sad about? Other people have it worse. Words that, even after 10 years of therapy, medications, a stint in a psychiatric ward, and many, many relapses of depression, still ring... Ah, damn hiccups. Still ring in my ears. Anywhere. Anytime. Every day. And they still cut just as deep. Review. Bloody Belt 7. What went wrong? Just when we thought Macroware uh, was done putting out unfinished games... We get this piping hot plate of spaghetti code. Frankly, I don't even know where to uh, where to start. From the story mode, which feels like it was cobbled together from the half-baked ideas of six writers working in different directions, or sorry, different time zones, to the non-intuitive tutorials, to the ridiculous lag that had me up making a fresh cup of coffee between each punch, and finally to the head. Uh, head scratching localization foul ups. Honestly, the dialogue makes no sense in any language. The hell were they uh, originally written in Swiss? <laughs> See, it's funny because they are Swedish <laughs> company. What the hell is that thing? Kings of Acid. Guessing a band or something? Where's the musical? Mixer. Remind me. Okay. Guess nothing else. Joss, meet V. Sophie, is this about my Randy? Joss, I, I... I don't know how to say this, but... Randy... was abducted. Abducted? You told me not to tell but her. He's alive, right? And you tell her one second later? River! We don't know. Tell me, damn it! Police caught the guy, but he caught a bullet and he's in a coma being watched. But where's Randy? We're working on it. We're looking, Joss. Here? Arguing's not gonna help anyone. He's my child. You got no place telling me how to behave. Joss. We need to look through Randy's stuff. Listen, we need to look through Randy's things. Why? To find any lead we can. Trust me, Joss. Don't destroy anything. Randy doesn't like it when anyone pokes through his stuff. Let's, see how it's Let's go, V. The kids are playing outside. Maybe that's why they have. Tell him like... it's time to eat. Maybe that's why uh, they had a connection of some sort. It's like mutual neurodivergence or something. What's on your mind? I think all the women in your life have character. That's the trailer. Eyes peeled for details, eh? Oh, wait. He doesn't live inside there with them? The Uncle is. River! Sup? Monique! Dorian. 
Hey, guys. Is this your girlfriend? No, just a friend. I have my own girlfriend. You gonna stay over? We'll see. Your mom's waiting for you with dinner. This is their old trailer. Randy moved in when I bought him a new one. Real hellhole. Like in my good old days. You check around, I'll check the trash. Okay, have fun. Got some kind of key here. Real fossil. Not quite what we're looking for, no. Didn't mean to do that, but all right. <sighs> yeah. Hangs out the Aldecados. Still see the nicks from those first years we measured the kids. Tainted Overlord. Oh, there. Favorite is. band. You know him well. He used to send him an album every year for his B day. Left his favorite hoodie in the closet. Hmm. Dear Mother Departs. The old die quietly, their hand, dry hands giving a faint rustle as they fall for the last time. They tend to depart this world in November, at the darkest hour of the night, when dawn seems just as far off as the spring that will never return. They leave little behind, a small stack of last century's newspapers, a few chipped cups, clothes already smelling of the casket. Under their closed eyelids flits a muted kaleidoscope of memories flashing by in no particular order. They die with their gaze fixed on the hardening diorama of a long a life that, in its final moments, always seem to have been far too short. Gotta steal as many. Some kind of game here. Shipping code on it. The hunt. The hunt is on. Wait, then I already have the key. Now I rehab the key. of tech. Randy had the scratch for this. You're joking. Hi, tech computer. Latest gen tech. Durable stainless steel. Honestly, nice little room. No chance Randy could afford hardware like this. Way too pricey. And we gotta get in. But I doubt anyone knows the password. Can you crack it? Yeah, we can try. Don't know how, River. Damn. Need to try to guess it then. What could he have? Painted overlords. 
27, 20, 76. Who's the girl? His ex, Natalie. Let's move. Let's go. Rounds of papal trousers, partners. Ex in the pick. What's her name? Natalie? Gonna have to keep trying. Come on, V. And Al Caldo's jacket? Keep sick. Used to be his dad's. Maybe Alda Caldo's, his pop's jacket. Uh, well, not working. Mm. Oh, here we go. Huh. Liberum Arbitrium. Dark shit. Sound could use work, but you can tell they put blood, sweat, and tears into it. B. Randy looks like his tag. <laughs> Why is the key keep respawning? All right. Give his tag a try. B. Randy. I'm pretty sure it's the song. That's that was my it. original assumption, which was the tainted, tainted uh, overlord. Punch this track title. Librum Arbitrium. That did it. Help me have a look around. Okay, move. Just files. Something deeply fucked about that cartoon. Yeah, I was gonna say. I My skin's crawling. By glint of sword, Randy Kutcher. Volume one of the Blades of Doom trilogy, chapter one, Ghosts of Ancestor Salvation. A silhouette of a gaunt female figure began to take shape among the ebb of the inky fog. By its long braid, the woman held a severed head only one eye socket clearly visible. Decay had already long begun to melt the face, the face's flesh, exposing the white of bone underneath. The other side fared much better. Then without uttering a sound, the woman shifted her gaze to pierce the eyes of the weary warrior. Come, kill me. I am ready for death. She shouted with a cold intensity, prepare to meet her last and sorry, to meet her end at last. Albereth, 2043 to 266, genius or psychopath. Black Metal has produced countless charismatic characters, but the uniqueness of Aiden Burroughs, known also by monikers Nema and Balbirith is perhaps in a class of its own in the genre. Vocalist, guitarist, bassist, songwriter, ideologue. Uh, some call him a genius, others a fucking psychopath. When a person like Burroughs becomes defined by polar extremes, it's no wonder when he begins to arouse curiosity outside the metal world. There's no diminishing the latest I'm oh, sorry, the lasting mark he's left on in black metal. But even music more broadly most agree he was the driving influence for a new wave of metal artists and bands, like Tainted Overlord, who have managed to claw their way up from the bowels of metal hell 
to the almost mainstream music scene. Sorry, Anthony Thirty. They caught Harris in a vehicle like that. I meant to call. Sorry, Look, spent half the day sitting Shit, in my River. Court. I remember that day. Police had all of Watson. He lives close to an old school. Blocked off, and I was stuck in traffic for hours trying to cross town. I kind of live in an area where I used to go to school, but it looks all different now. So trying to find ways past all those jams made it easy to get all turned around. Hope you're not mad. Hey, no problem. I need to help my mom anyways. Um, do you have everything ready for your place? Almost. Thanks. I just want to say thanks. True angel of empathy, this guy. Huh? Okay. I just want to say thanks. Guess in general, I'm just holding on to the thought that there's more people like me out there doing the same shit. Why are you helping us anyways? I used to be like you. Like all of you. I wasn't spared any of life's cruel twists and turns. Worst of it was when my best friend died. Shit, sorry to hear that. Can I ask what happened? Rare muscle disease. His body just got weaker and weaker until he was shadow of himself. I wanted to help him more than anything but there was just no possible way I could. Of course, anyone who could help, uh, he couldn't afford. If he just had the means, he could have bought some super drug or new body or I don't know. Worse luck than the disease was being born into a poor family. Anyway, that's why I do what I do. I couldn't help my best chum, but just maybe there are some people out there in the world I can help. Big trouble in Haywood. Hey, I hope you don't mind. Figured out Randy's identity. Sent him the game as a present. The one you found in his drawer? The same. Shipping code suggests the prick sent it from the Badlands. Hey, I hope you don't mind, but I use my admin privileges to find you in real life. That is your home address. Sorry. Hope it's not too weird, but I had a good reason. There's a gift on its way, a game called Big Trouble in Haywood. Uh, you know it? Anyways, hope you like it. Have fun. Fucked up again. This guy baited Randy like a pro. I'm toking again. I'm sorry. I don't know why I keep doing it. I guess I'm just a piece of shit. A perfectly normal person, Randy. You're just like anyone else with a can of cart still beating in their chest. Remember, I'm always here to talk to you, uh, talk to, to understand you, to help you. I know you'll recover from this like you always have. Natalie, thanks for yesterday. The city from up on that tower looks so beautiful. Honestly, I felt speechless. Though maybe that's just because I don't love heights. Uh... Really, it was nice, but maybe next time I take you into the city, head to Japantown, grab a bite. You'll love it once you see it. And oh my god, the restaurant my aunt takes me to sometimes, so Nova. Yeah, so many. <laughs> uh, what do you say? Do you? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? No. Oh, there's no way. Why would he do that? Not only did they agree to meet, but it looks like Randy was as excited as any kid on his way to a theme park. Fuck. This creep definitely scrambled Randy's head. I might just be innocent, guys. All right, let's give it a chance for me to read it all before you start talking. Anyways, uh, what do you say? Tell you what, I think your site's really Nova. I think I'm ready to finally meet up in person. Same time and place you wrote before. Because, man, I just can't wait now. Ah. That's right. Same as we agreed. It makes me happy to hear you're happy. Just one tiny request. Delete that first email I just sent, just in case. Don't want anyone sniffing around something that doesn't concern them. That's what this feels like. This feels like a futuristic, uh... Ted Bundy, maybe? Yeah, I would say something like that. 
Or no. Dahmer. Feels more like Dahmer, actually. Family. I understand I didn't have a normal family either. Uh, my mom died when... Uh, my mom died young, and my dad he just tried to give me a future. It wasn't easy, though, to make a living on a farm once the cattle pestilence took hold. Eventually, it all just fell out beneath his feet. The cattle, the business, deep depression took his life. I tell you this so you know you're not the only one who's lost a father. I understand you so well. The only real difference is that it, it was nomads that stole your dad from you. And for me, it was corrupt corpse and their dirty money grabs. That's why I hid all my activities from the corpse. Uh, trauma team and biotechnica would be all over me in a second if they knew what I got up to. But I don't have to explain all that to you, Randy. You get it. I know you'll keep all this, uh, all this between us, Chumbas. Stay strong, buddy. I know you got a. I know you got it in you. This is pretty fucked. Natalie must have been the only person Randy trusted. Can we view this page with a link? We'll look in a minute. Hey, Nat. Check out the site. Drugs are bad. When you're there, click the image, the red one with people in it. The hell is this? Some kind of cult? Like, how'd you even find this? Just cruising the net. Doesn't matter. Uh, you alive? Hey, you won't answer my texts. Won't answer my hollows. Still alive, man? I have a special delivery for you. From a Valentino tomb of mine. You just gotta pick up. Pick it up. Anyone in Haywood would give both kidneys for this thing, and I'm still holding it for you, free of charge, like some gonk. Do me a favor and answer, because I'm starting to get pissed. <sighs> some kind of link. The one Randy wrote about? Let's find out. The hidden page set up by Anthony Harris. Christ. Oh, I'm gonna be sick. Tony's shelter. Welcome, Lost Stranger. Good to see you, friend. Welcome to Tony's Haven. The place you've been looking for. The place where you can become the best version of yourself, thanks to Tony. I live here with my friends. They came here because they were fed up uh, with seeing their life go to waste. Just like you. Think of me as a farmer who looks after his livestock. Get acquainted and stick around. Together, we'll show these old farms what we're capable of. No idea what I'm talking about? Don't worry. I'll explain everything in good time. But it's time for you to decide. Do you want to remain a shadow of yourself or become the person you always dreamed of being? Come on down. There was a file here. Deleted, it looks like, but the name's still there. That name. Yeah, it's over here. Wasn't the video file on Randy's comp called something like that? Hey, look. The name of this cartoon matches the missing file on Harris's page. That's what we needed to find for Yawin. V, we've got it. Randy must have downloaded it. Sure, but V, don't you get it? This could be the key to Harris's mind. Here's open. Hey, uh. Can you use any of that Netrunner magic to shake anything else out of this? Get Paris's IP. I don't think so. Lack the skills for that. Not that kind of magician. Oh, okay. We'll have to manage without it. That cartoon, River, could be what we've been looking for. Said yourself we need something that'd get Harris to dream. Send it to Yawin. Right. Sending it now. Okay. Says she'll get back to me by morning. And that I am a son of a bitch. 
And, uh, uh, come on, let's grab a bite. Listen, let's not worry Joss more than we need to, huh? We're hot on the trail, we'll know more tomorrow. That's it. All right, he'll wait. Okay, cool. Come on, man. get up there. There you go. You selling new or used threads? Used. Nobody's willing to ship any new stock all the way out here. But who am I to complain? You just have to tread the highway, peek into the wreckage. Sharp eye will always pick up something. Hmm? <laughs> Looking for some decent outerwear. You're in luck. Our prices are out of this world. Get it? Anyways. Dweeb. Alright. Sixteen thousand. What are you smoking? You just said no one wants to come out here to buy your crap. And you're selling things for 16k? Oh, like, eat a whole bag of dicks. Alright, put all those shops are there around here. Speaking of, ooh, wait, I actually might be able to do this now. Ah, fuck. Don't know where I got the five perks available from. I think I wonder which things I was doing. Return aftermath of the great nomad tragedy. Most sources indicate that the government of Peru, Brazil, and Chile have come to a solution for the so called nomad problem. In an attempt to prevent the illegal transact transnational movement and typically temporary settlement of nomad clans across South American continent, they plan to seal all borders to undocumented persons of dubious origin. Uh, pro Protestation, protestations from scholars, human rights groups, and even corporate representatives have thus far been ignored. Some corporations have voiced concerns that stifling the flow of migrant work could lead to economic decline and unpredictable social unrest. For example, some experts predict the locally local brazilian workforce will simply be too small to meet the employment demands of ongoing major agro corp ventures oh, this, okay. this push for tightened anti-nomad immigration policies has come as yet another heavy blow from south american governments against an already heavily targeted demographic more information continues to surface about the so-called long return where hundreds of thousands of nomads 
uh, nomads lost their jobs without warning and had their equipment, much of it personal, not company property, illegally seized by the government authorities. Most laborers were relocated from North America sp specifically for this work and without corporate support were forced to vacate the hazardous area, formerly home to Amazon rainforest in a week's time. With their only lifeline suddenly severed and no legal basis for staying, many dozens of thousands attempted to find a way home, even if that means walking much of it, much of that distance. Initial reports showed staggering figures for the number who died during the mass exodus. Many still ask why. Who benefits from these anti-nomad policies and border closures, if not the South American nations or corporations? Many speculate that lobbyists from Orbital Air and other lunar colony representatives played a key part. Their objective, some alleged, is to limit opportunities for migrant contact, contract work so more will be forced to for the sake of survival to accept employment in the notoriously difficult labor conditions of low earth orbit and on the moon. That's pretty shitty. Tell me you found something. Got a strong lead. Looks like Randy knew his kidnapper. They were in touch. Why would he do something like that? You know him. Kids. Look for help in the wrong places. When's the last time you ate? Yesterday. Have mine. I'm not hungry. Yeah, you're a big boy. Make sure you eat. Thanks. Maybe later. River, tell me and be honest. Will you find him? River's a great investigator. River's a hell of an investigator. Brandy's good as found. Won't give up until I do, Joss. Look, dead or alive, we're finding him. Joss. That's the important. You mind if V takes Randy's trailer for the night? No. Sure. Stay in, right? You gotta help me see this through. To the end. Yeah, sure. Of course I'll stay. Yeah. Find your way, all right? Yep. Gonna go hit the sack soon. Must be hard for you. Hello. Can't be easy raising three kids on your own. Well, it wasn't any easier with my husband. In fact, the best days were when he didn't come home. Why is that? There were times I wished he'd disappear for a month just to not have him hang around. Why? It was that bad? That bad, huh? His bike in the highway. That was his world. But at home... Let me tell you a story. This one time he took Dorian into the city. Had some errand to run, just father and son. He came back that night, dead-ass drunk. Raging at me for calling the cops on him. Did you? River found him in some dive and brought Dorian home. How do you die? How do you die? Thael de Caldos told me he died an honorable death. Whatever the hell that means. Hell, he probably got wiped by that. They showed me his body, where his face used to be. Couldn't see the honor in that. <laughs> yeah, he probably was one of the idiots that rushed with Scorpion to that uh, AV we shot down. <laughs> So you're relieved now? Must have been a relief then, when he left. For weeks, I cried every night. My husband was killed. The father of my children. I, I, I'm That's sorry. Confusing. Randy changed. He locked up. Not to mention the other two I still had to raise. Life was rough with him and without him. Sometimes there's no solution. Gotcha. Kobayashi Maru. Anyways, let's change the subject. Let's, uh, change this subject. Stay strong. Hang in there, Joss. Uh -huh. 
don't got it. I didn't even get to go to bed. I just touched the door. V, wake like up. My brain turned off. Not done sleeping. Yawin called. It worked. The cartoon. He's dreaming. You, yeah, cool. you got cool. the BD? Right here. Slot it in. Jack into the computer. I want to see it on the monitor. Okay. <laughs> that dock of yours is quick. Not bad. Anthony, I have to report this. I hope you understand that. This isn't normal behavior. Anthony, Chubby buffaloes. You killed Liam's turtle. He was sick. He wouldn't eat, stayed in his shell. I just wanted to help him. By injecting him with HGH? What were you thinking? Is this something your father Is this taught you? Good people took you in, extended their trust. This is how you repay them? Your friend died. I understand. But that is no excuse. Growth hormone. Okay, yeah, yeah. Fuck you. What did you just say? Stab okay. with the fork. I've had enough. Principal's gonna hear about this. Your foster parents, too. I see. Like father, like son. Wait, I was joking about the stabbing on thing. I was like a little Don't predator. Don't dare talk about my dad! That's right, you little shit. I know it all. Farm failed. Dad put a bullet in his head. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! You can't talk about my dad, you you prick! You you can! You you can! He he was sick, weak. I just wanted to help him. Oh, huh. I don't like the audio is turned on one side. What's the matter with you, back in Harris's school? I have to report this. I hope you understand that. I'm trying to scam, but I keep forgetting it doesn't work. Fuck you. What did you just say? Yeah. Alright. Okay, I got it. It's not letting me. There it goes. Drugs are bad, subject poison. Oh, I'll recognize this shooting. To 2044. It was a case study back at the academy. Give me a sec to check which yeah, school. Yeah, 2044 is school shooting. Laguna Bend. Oh, looks like the whole town got flooded in the 50s. Well, at least we know the general area where Harris lived. Guess that'd be that. Oh fuck! This kid has that mask on too. Trophy, old one, dating from 2042, first place in an interscholastic wrestling tournament. Don't you dare talk about my dad! That's right, you little shit. Shut up, shut up, shut up! You, you can! You, you can! He, he was sick, weak. I just you want to help him. Tony! Oh, what the fuck? Oh. Where are you going now? 
Come here! Coming! Tony, come here! Y yeah, Dad? You forget something? I asked you a question! I... I don't know. Choline, I'm at thy nine levels. See anything odd? Um... Too low? You were supposed to check before school. What do you gotta say for yourself? Cow's gonna die because of you. Gonna kill it like you killed your mama. I... I'm sorry. Don't apologize. Just dial up her hormones. And shut off that goddamn cartoon! How many times I gotta tell you not to leave it like that, hmm? Half the day I spent trying to turn that shit off. supposed to be. Ah, that's our cartoon. Tony really seemed to love it. Guess that'd be that. Harris looks even younger here. Yep. Hey! Where are you going now? What's it want me to scan? Let's see if this kind of shows anything shiny. Sorry, male. Farmers build, mid 21st century, Texas origin, physical resemblance to Anthony Harris, father. Looks like a cattle bio scanner for checking vitals. Uh, controls automated uh, systems. Tell me, come here. Yeah, yeah. Get something. And shut up that goddamn cart. Cattle injectors for hormones, antibiotics. People ate meat loaded with this shit. Two. How many times I gotta tell you not to leave it like that? Hmm? Half the day I spent trying to turn the. Supplements in the feed for disease-free livestock. Apple-flavored hormones. Now, <sighs> oh, so he's back at the farm.
I'm guessing that's the dude that died on the news. And where are you up to, Mike? Come here, you rascal. You'll hurt yourself. Tony will take good care of you. Easy now. Okay. I think this might be the place, V. It's a recent memory. Gotta be his hideout. Let me see him in the light. Ah, oops. I can't go lower. It kind of looks like one of those military school dropouts. Got some cables. Panel. Use for powering farm devices. Got a clock. An hour to midnight. Special design for agricultural use. Looks like Peter Pan turned this farm into a goddamn final bastion. Turret and anti personnel mine parts. You um, must have been an auto shop or something here at some point. Sound effects of heavy AV. Hearing what I'm hearing? Trash barge. That's the signal the dump. Has to be a landfill nearby. Oh, fuck me. Treats the kidnapped boys like cattle. Machine controls an injection system for stimulants, hormones, something. <sighs> Look, another one. Aggressive. Large thyroid, muscular atrophy, brain dan brain receiving beta waves. Don't see Randy anywhere. Pumped with hormones and conscience. Fire department certain stamp right here. City South. Perfect. Terminal controls the pens. Gotta be another deck somewhere for the mines and turrets. Great, nervous, elevated muscle tension. Signage on the farm model points to Petrochem. Hey, the Illuminated Towers. Promoting the Us Cracks album that came out then. Colors changed every hour. I think that might be it. Our lights, colors change every hour. Brought to you Not by so sure, Us Cracks. Think we ought to explore a bit more. Okay. Let's go with your gut. 
Is there a way to do that? I want to check that's the other one. Be all she wrote in this one, v. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I want to go to the last one, Dan, so and see who that weird dude was. I mean, I know it's okay. Funny. So, where do we sit now exactly? We know Harris still lives near an old school that's now underwater. You can see the NC skyline and the US Cracks towers from the farm. It's a few miles out. Farms located near a landfill. We know that too. Shipping code on the game Randy got from Harris traces out to the Badlands. Those towers promoting the US Cracks album. Colors change regularly, once an hour. So we know the time. Eleven at night. Right. And that puts the farm east of the city. Southeast, actually. Stamp on the NCFD certificate was from the southern region. Farm model's a petrochem design, so that eliminates any others. Which narrows it down to Edgewood Farm. That's gotta be our place. So... we've got it. Just hope we didn't so fuck smart. it up. Come on, we gotta go. Kids try to fight back and we're gonna beat them up, but you know, not kill them. <laughs> Just like when you deal with uh, real FPWs and whatnot. Damn it! Let this work. It's gotta work. It's gotta work. Done more in two days than the NCPD accomplished in weeks. Not hard to do, but yeah, you're right. Thanks, V. For everything. You'd think that finding serial killer we'll type people murder. would be like the only thing that CPD's good at. The sooner how we felt. Since it has nothing to do with corporate. What was eating at him? This isn't your fault. I'm his uncle, V. And I wasn't there for him. Drive like you stole it, dude. Why are we driving 20? Fuck! You're fine. Why is he driving so slow? Hold on, Randy. Please hold on. Get out Grab now something. Before. We have turrets. River, this is the farm. We got it. I know. Let's get to the barn quick.
River, I swear to God, if you set off one of these mines, I'm going to fight you. more for the kids' safety than anything else. I gotta take out the turrets next. But just in case they start trying to escape, you know, from the place, they don't just instantly blow their own legs off and stuff. Be a real hassle. close. By the barn, two more turrets. That front... I suppose if I just find the control panel, I won't have to keep doing this. <laughs> so, probably attempt to do that in a sec. Oh, like everything in life, always pick the suckiest way to do it, and you're less likely to run into bad stuff. Like turrets, in this case. Here, just in case, grab that.
the office with the uh, controls, I would think. But I already disabled it. What the fuck? What are they doing? Dude, that's such bullshit. Joy of influence. Five simple rules. Exude authority, speak with conviction in absolutes, and never ever lose excuse me, confidence in yourself. Practice rule of reciprocity. It's reciprocity. Anyways, reciprocate things. Uh, make sure people always feel like they owe you something. Be unavailable. Make yourself seem like a very busy person whose time is more valuable than theirs. Even um, a meeting is there is a sacrifice. Demand engagement. Remember, if a client is forced to give up, give you enough attention, backing out will be even harder. Make them like you. People like people who are similar to them. Never forget it. Gross. Are you kidding me? Good. I went through the window this whole time. Manipulation, easier than you think. The most fundamental yet effective manipulation technique is what we call undermining. For the manipulator to get the target to do what he or she wants, the target must first accept the manipulator's opinion as true or valuable. This is the easiest to achieve by making the target feel inferior uh, through harsh criticism. The more accurate, the better. The target will begin to yearn for praise for the, from the manipulator, becoming more open to cooperation. That is manipulation. Gross. They deserve the crucifixion. <laughs> or at least the sword, out of minimum. gotta be here have a look around the consciousness cure curse man dies the way he was born soft weak and helpless death the one certainty in the universe of chaos can be both a tragic end and a release <sighs> and a release from suffering it can come as an unexpected twist or as a beautiful crowning counterpart 
to a life well lived. The curse uh, we face as humanity, uh, the only living beings in constant awareness of death, is our inordinate uh, focus on the fact. No, sorry. Let me reread that. The curse we face as humanity, the only living beings in constant awareness of death, is our in inordinate focus on the fact. How much happier is life of the gazelle that escapes the cheetah's clutches, thinking that it invaded, evaded death once and for all, then the poor soul living out its days knowing each step inches him closer to the void. Brain Dance Kit. With the, this Brain Dance Kit, you are able to play all commercial brain dances formatted on compatible data storage media. For safety and certification reasons, this device should never be modified or tampered with in any way. Should you have technical questions or concerns, please contact an accredited technician. If used in ways other than those designed, personal injury and damage to the device may occur. Please retain the following information in the event uh, the device is put up for resale or given to a third party after purchase setup move kit from packaging insert brain dance media into the drive slot or use provided cable to connect Ooh, look uh, to a parent device sit in a calm quiet area and place the device on your head turn on the device and enjoy your brain dance experience. No, accepting the above terms, conditions, instructions means you waive any responsibility on the part of the manufacturer and all affiliated parties for any injuries and damages incurred during the use of this device. Enjoy. I can help you. Hello, I'm happy to see you signed up for my help program. I'd like to hear more about you. What's your name? what's been bothering you. They really matter? I'm nobody. I'm a zero. Nobody cares about me, but thanks for pretending to anyway. Give me a chance. Whatever. I'm Sean. Been thinking about death a lot lately. How nothing really matters and why even try. My folks don't want me to be an embarrassment, but I'm a piece of shit, so fuck me, right? I keep fucking up and trying harder is just more miserable can't even get out of bed most days so yeah guess that's it let me help sean i know how to solve every one of your problems you're worth more than you think trust me tony it's all real hello you ask in the application if this is all real is this is all for real i can assure you ray ray bongo it is that it absolutely is Let's take the next step, and you'll see for yourself, of course, before I can help you. It would be better if we got to know each other first, don't you think? My name's Tony. And you? Fuck off, Tony. <laughs> Hello. You have... N Sorry, don't worry. Hello. You have nothing to worry about. Everything you say stays between us. First, just tell me a little about yourself. Nothing to tell. My dad's dead. I live in a shithole with my mom, bro and sis, and I got an amazing girlfriend who's wasting her time on me. I have a cop uncle who still wants to make something out of me. Yeah, good luck. Not that we talk much these days anyway. What else? Oh, I'm poor and a fucking waste of air and space. At least my dad had respect. I got nothing. Can't even afford any chrome. Only thing I did get lately was my ass beat by my chooms. My mom wanted to flatline herself once, so I can't talk to her about anything. Or I'll be the reason she slits her wrists. Hard to see how things can things get any worse. 
but even harder to see how they can get better. My whole life's a fucking cosmic joke. The first step to improving your life is acknowledging where it has failed. Good news is that first step is already behind you. Ooh. I've been in your shoes before. I know how you feel, and I know how to help. Let me in. Open up, and everything will be fine in no time. You'll see. Fantastic news. Hello. I'm thrilled to hear you overcame your illness. That tells me just how strong you are inside. But it's always good to have the strength of others support you, too. The rehabilitation is the next step on the road to healing. You have already healed your soul. Now let me take care of your body. Together, I know we can't fail. Try disabling the defense system, then haul ass to the barn. Alright. Tinkerbell. Deals less damage, but with a chance to knock out the target using a strong attack. So it's a uh, cattle prod? That's rude. Green dance kit. Alright, some stuff. I can help you. Give me a chance. So this is all real. Don't worry. Fantastic news. Okay. Alright, that should do it. Top 8 Dangers Juice, the animal's favorite drink, a miracle elixir. The dream come true to every scrawny twig-limbed skeletor that dreams of having boulders and chesticles. But is it safe? Apparently it poses particular problems for men. 8 problems to be exact. Here are the top 8 dangers of using juice. Temporary increase in sexual ability, followed by a sharp decline. Men are also at risk of priapism. Perpetual erection sounds shimra, but it could be painful. Gynocomastia, i.e. enlarged breasts, often irreversible. So they get boobies, big old bobbles. Right. Balding on the head, but increased hair growth on the chest, back, and stomach, and legs. That yeah, sucks. It's all the hair you don't want. <laughs> uh, changes in your skin, such as acne on the face and shoulders. Kidney problems resulting in increased protein content in urine. Ugh. Kidney scarring may be an indication of focal segment glomerulosclerosis. Okay. Anyways, that one. Uh, muscles may grow asymmetrically, uh, often leading to muscle weave tearing. Prostate cancer. It'll hurt every time you take a piss. And finally, the winner, liver failure, resulting in jaundice and uh, pruritic rash, and even fibrosis and cancer of the liver. Still interested? Not scared of the risks? 
Well then, good luck. And see you in the hospital. Yeah, I can see the loop from here. Oh, there it is. Just where I saw another one. Maybe it was just that one. Damn it. Locked up tight. Need to find another way. Grab it, V. There you go. Alright, back up to here. Let's see if we can find a way in. Oh, wait, yeah. River! Do is walk Come here, here, quick! You alive? Come on, eyes open. Help's on the way. I get these damn doors open. If I do that, it'll just kill Randy. Him. 1052. I repeat, I've got a 1052 at a farm south of the city. Yes, send the fucking squad! Yeah, relaying coordinates now. No, several, at least. Do it quick, damn it! Oh, and watch for automated defenses on site. They're substantial. Hurry, gotta shut it off. <sighs> Chemicals, the invisible killer. We've long known that the AVs cry crisscross. Uh, sorry. That the AVs crisscrossing our skies are busy dumping harmful substances in the air, such as aluminum, carbon dioxide, sulfur trioxide, and sulfuric acid. Studies have also revealed that the presence of dead red blood cells in E. coli, as well as sodium chloride table salt. That's so weird. What do they claim about other stuff? Oh, wait, I'm not reading that. killer um, table salt now you don't need a degree in science to know the harm these substances can wreak on the body we found that sulfur compounds can lead to cancer heart disease and other illnesses arising from weakened or damaged immune system they can also lead to spontaneous dental hydroplosion and acute meningitis mm. Okay, all disconnected. Check the others. Could still be alive. Right. That's a shit in here. Where's my night vision? What's going on with my eyes? Really quick. Yeah, it should be in. Yeah, it's just not working right now, specifically. Alright, so that's our boy. there. You're all right now. <sighs> Been dead a few days already. V, help me with 
Brandy. One second. You asked me to check them. I'm still breathing. It's okay. Don't don't be scared. We're here to help. A bit dehydrated, but you are gonna be fine. V, help me with Brandy. Need to loosen. I'm stronger than River could ever be. You tell me I can't lift this damn thing? trauma team we did it river yep we sure did but i'm not about to leave it like this the horror that bastard inflicted can't let it go what do you mean they nabbed him already it's not going anywhere what's your plan what do you want to do zero him exactly Squeeze the life out of him with my bare hands. That sick stupid. fuck has to die. I'll do it. Oh, River, come on, man. It won't change anything. Anthony Harris is a sad sack of meat hooked up to a respirator now. For how long? He has to die. It's the only way I'll be sure. Stop. Gonna throw your life away getting revenge on a brain dead vegetable? Well, I don't know. Maybe you're right. But it's driving me crazy not doing anything. Joss and Randy will need you. Actually, got quite a bit you can do, River. Joss, Randy, the kids. They're gonna need you now more than ever. Yeah. No, you're right. Forget about Harris. Go on with your life. Forget about Harris. Take one day at a time, but rest first. Once your head's on straight again, give me a hollow. We'll talk. Yeah, need a little time to myself now, but then I'll call you. I will. Hey, we're ready for evac. Are you riding along or not? Really, V. Thanks. Couldn't have done it without you. Wait, we could have rode with no trauma problem. team. Oh, it's just a don't yeah, be a stranger. Go merc them. Hey, max level. I was gonna say, can I stand? It just doesn't want me riding the trauma team. I was definitely gonna leap on top. They knew. Yeah, I spoke with Elizabeth. She confirmed what you told me. How long has it been going on for? I can't remember when this could have started. But that's just it, isn't it? I can't even trust my own memories. Who knows how much of it is fake? I remember my brother, I think. It's hard to say why he, is he suddenly in my memories. Elizabeth showed me that room you found. Uh, what the fuck is going on? I feel like I'm not in control of anything anymore. They were in my home. My home, for fuck's sake. I won't sleep until I catch these motherfuckers. No, they weren't just in my home. They were my fucking home. The whole place is bugged. Jesus Christ, V. If they're in my home, that means they're here too. They must already know about you. <laughs> Good luck, Jefferson. <laughs> now, what are you planning to do now? <laughs> I guess I'll wait for the long reply somewhere else.
area is secure. All witnesses questioned and victims are en route. Air contact not found. Yeah, Have Ramirez debrief with her boys here. They'll be gathering evidence till morning. Poor boys. All your years ever seen anything like this? Eight years in the force. Nothing comes close. Beyond twisted. That was fun. Okay, so the next ones are just afterlife. Let's go talk to this. Is it a mirage? A hologram? No, my friends. It's clear, open skies. But don't take it from me. Get out there and enjoy the sun. over at the other screen for one second. At the same time, I don't know what made me think he was going to go left, but yeah.
¡Qué lost! That's all. Listen, got a yarn for you. Quick biz, that is. You interested? Yep. All right, lay it on me. I was cruising the net, you feel? And I spotted an interesting classified. Wait, let me guess. Performance enhancers? He used Mr. Stud cheap. Mr. Stud. <laughs> now, I'm a serious man, V. And serious matters are what, if not all, that concern me. Somebody's selling a book of spells. Edition dating from before the first net crash. Now, you know a thing or two about that, don't you? Like, how much that soft could run you and earn you. Want me to clup it for you, don't you? Uh-uh. No clupping required. Just buy the damn thing. Reimburse you twofold. Okay. Can't you get Sending it? Sending me out to do your shopping? Want a case of Nicola with that? Algae chips? Think on it, V. A treasure, and someone's willing to part with it. Now who does that? The hard up, V. And Desperado's got this unsavory side. They're unpredictable. One word off their mood, and they reach for their heat. That's why I need you to meet the seller. You got heat at the ready. Gotcha. Okay. Will do. Okay. Will do. That's my girl. Zipping you the deets on the cellar. And luck be with you all the way. Good job for you. Uh, shared contact information. Got it. Thanks. Oh, man. V! Hey! Hey, we're not done yet. So, ready? Rogue should be here any minute. Hey, you looking for the book? That's right. Sounds about right. Price non-negotiable. You'll need to pay in full on pickup. Clear enough. Agreed. Prem, I flipped you the address. Come by your lonesome. Always do. work alone so it's peasy. Don't even got a dog. I do have a cat though. I wonder how Selena's doing. Hope she's been good. And after this mission maybe we'll go visit Judy real quick.
<laughs> Wasn't me. Funny if it was Judy or someone I know. Okay, so. Uh, yeah. Here Spellbook. Forward. You got it? I do indeed. Tucked away somewhere safe. You want okay. coordinates? I need to see my money. Wait, that's it? Service here at Hardwire is shit these days. Wait, wait, before I do that, just in case I can't come back from it. Ouch. Hardwire customer service just ain't what it used to be. Huh? I have no idea what you're talking about. Sure you do. Got a pretty good idea of who you are. Bargain basement dress suit, back alley implants. You are almost a cutout from a corp recruiting brochure. Hang on, this is fun. Let me guess. Uh, found something in a dusty corner of the warehouse, trying to hawk it off on the side. Oh, what would your manager say? I mean, not like your KPIs can include your under-the-counter deals. Oh, the fuck you want? Okay. Why you not doing anything chill. stupid? Not make any gonk moves. I'll pay you. But if this isn't worth my while, if it's a con by just a hair, I'll crush you. Got it? Yes. And fuck you again. Just flipped you the coordinates. Mm hmm. We'll see. Okay. Like the good ones. Ah, I forgot the bamboo is like invincible here. <laughs> Zeta Tech XPR. <laughs> Gotta be like 50 years old. Least that. Had one, you know. Top of the line back in the day. I'm getting, uh, getting reimbursed, so I don't really care. Practice here. It's five, one C, F, F, B. BBS rumor mills actually churned out some truth. That Zeta Tech 4 is a fucking Alcatraz. Modified pit bulls at each entry port, speed traps, and see ya at access points. Soon as I step foot on, in their net, they set flatline on my ass. Uh, nice try, Zeta. But a little aardvark and killer six combo meal uh, did away with that. But for real. It wasn't easy. My trusty Elysia... Alisla? I don't know, however you say that. 
was smoking like a flare gun by the end of it. But I got the job done. Don't believe me? Check it for yourself. I left a little note at the top of the Zeta Fortress where their logo used to be. Spider Murphy was here. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, fuck. He actually did it. Bart Moss unleashed data crash. Whole net's falling apart before my very eyes. Data fusing together. Fortresses melting like ice cream. One's zeros flooding the information highway. Uh, global stock market's losing its shit. Dow Jones dropped by hundreds in a single hour. King Tao CEO committed suicide. Netwatch is running around like a headless chicken. Holy fuck, say goodbye to the old order. Death to corpse, whoop. Bart Moss was wrong. Everyone was wrong. The net was a mirror held up for our thought to our thoughts and dreams. Our lives. Bart Moss took it and shattered it into pieces, thinking that that would be enough. But as it happened, you can still see your reflection in every shattered piece of glass. Now instead of one mirror, we have thousands of them. Every corp, government, gang now has their own net that they rule with an iron fist. With no regulation, no accountability, surveillance hasn't disappeared in the hands of those who govern us. It's only gotten worse. They're like modern day uh, fates with optic cables of our lives wrapped around their chrome fingers ready to cut at a moment's notice. They hear our, our frustrations. They look upon our futile rebellion and they laugh. They laugh so hard the whole world uh, trembles at its very core. Yep. Don't you pull up to the line, asshole. There. I honestly can't see people that do that at you get to the red light and you don't stop at the line where you're supposed to be. Said you stopped like three cars behind. So annoying. Yeah, it goes it goes pretty well. How you doing, buddy? Oops, shoot. Almost eat your rear end. Yeah, the way. Brake checks. Once they put car combat in the game with the DLC, I'm gonna replay this um, as a new game plus, so and this is gonna be my new game plus character. And there's going to be a lot more car violence, I feel. <laughs> like, I'm just going to... Oh, you want to brake check me? Got stuck accelerating. Poor car. Oh wait, no, it's the next turn. Oh my god. I'm sorry. <laughs> yes, yeah, this one. Sometimes I feel like driving a car normally in this game, but literally never happens. I've tried. It's like the most infuriating thing ever. Like I'll do it in Grand Theft Auto, no problems. Like, yeah, people drive a little stupid and stuff, but that's, like, half the fun. But half the time in this game, people just don't drive. They just decide, now nah, I'm going to sit in the middle of the road. And it's like, bro, like, you're in the middle of the intersection. They're like, I don't care. <laughs> it just, oh, it grumps me out. Or I'm just like, fuck this gas. <laughs> All gas, no brakes. <laughs> uh, let's get our payday. So, ready? No. Rogue should be here any minute. Hey, Do it in a minute. Hey. Uh, I was talking. Your mom was talking. So, All right. you got the book? Yep. You got my Eddie's? As I says, V, I am a serious man. Amount is agreed. All yours. Thank you. 
That was worth heaps more. You know it. I know it. Nah, thanks, thanks a bunch. Don't mention it. It's money well deserved. Nix. You have received a transfer from Nix. Oh, thank you. Oh, did you guys hear that the new blades in the works? I don't know why looking at him reminded me of Wesley Snipes. Uh, the new blades in the works. I'm so excited. All right, we can do that, or we can wait for the race. I think I want to wait for the race because we got time. So we could do one race today and then uh, knock out that shipping in. Hey, hey. Hey. Wait till it's sundown. Hopefully she'll call by then. Not done yet. So, ready? The rogue should be here any minute. It had to have been like three days since the last race, so I don't know what's taking you so long. I didn't know Night City could have sandstorms inside the city. Day for contact. I try call, calling her. Pretty sure it is gas. like two days I literally slept during the river mission <sighs> give me a call lady I wish to drive. Thank you, you know, sometimes they don't call when I'm inside the vehicle, so they try to open up for a second. Bad stutters all of a sudden. Said she had a job for someone with an eye for virtues. I already did. Told that. her to drop you a line. Thanks for thinking of me. Nice of you to think of me, Judy. Hey, don't mention it. I just hope she's worth the eddies. Uh, it's a Ugh, what a dumpster fire of a case. You managed to crack it? In a manner of speaking. What else is going on besides that? Ah, uh, you know, same old. Rather hear where you've been up to. What's new with the monks? Yeah, where is uh, where's her apartment? 
crap. I think it's that one. It's the only other house I should have. And that's the Pan Am one. I'm gonna guess it's that one. Yeah, it Susie probably. isn't giving me the time of day, as usual. Uh, why'd you join them in the first place? How'd you hook up with the Mox in the first place? I thought Susie and the gang could really change something in this city. I believed in them. Winded up business as usual? I mean, I wouldn't go that far. Few Joy Toys' lives really change for the better thanks to them. You should become their leader. Couldn't you replace Susie and lead the mods? <laughs> no way in hell. I'll stick with tuning virtues, thank you very much. If you haven't noticed, I'm not much of a people person. What's your problem? Got another question on my mind. Shoot. Some lady called me Elizabeth something. Yeah. I mean, that was a fun mission, but it was really kind of butt cheeks that I couldn't help, really. You ever recorded any cool radio? I was virtue tuning and going. Scroll anything preem lately? Depends what you call preem. Does smut count? Uh, how'd you get into it? How'd you get into virtues, anyway? I always had a techie streak ever since I was a little kid. When I felt my first virtue, I was like, hey, I can make this way better. So I tried, and I did. And then it just snowballed from there. That's cool. Guess I kind of have to be into a little bit of everything. When it comes to virtues, I'm mostly in it for the intel. You mean seeing who killed who using what? Yeah, something like that. But you see it differently. For you, it's art. Why do you work in porn? <laughs> Always wondered. Why the smut industry? Isn't it obvious? Two, Two minutes, minutes of, of real feels a week's pay. Sure, but... I thought someone like you wouldn't be into the whole objectification thing. Objectification? Not, Not in my, my virtues. virtues. My, my actors, actors love what they, they do, and that's, that's why everyone, everyone wants, wants to feel them. Can't, can't fake old school emotions. emotions. Something else I wanted to talk about? Got all the time in the world. It was nice catching up. I'm right coming home, baby girl. Call me anytime. I know you're home. Wifey, I've arrived. Oh, wait, I forgot you're in here. Let's see, but why is she doing the cyber psycho hum? That part bothers me. Whoa, whoa. Bushido, complete BD collection. Oh, whoa, whoa. The Bushido Collection in BD format. First three are collector's items nowadays. You are right there, Chief? Are you gonna say something? Collector's Edition, Bushido 1 through 9. Deluxe, limited edition collection of Bushido movie series. Seen all her stuff. Alright, I guess there's two things I haven't seen yet. Untitled. Hope you've had a chance to save her what happened back there. You fucked up what was a done deal to begin with. We were so close, I count on you. But of course, having your way was more important. And you lost. I know how much you hate, hate losing. I'm glad I know that. I hope that whenever you fix your makeup in the mirror, you'll see a face of a person who fucked up not only the other doll's life, uh, but her own because of your own pathetic narcissism, and that you despise it so much, sorry, as much as I do. Yeah, I cut her head off, Jeeves. Everything alright? Hey, Rox. How's it going? How are things at Clouds? No, dude, nothing's all right. Tigers went and got payback after the shit we pulled. They jumped us and started pumping lead. Tom still had his upgraded chip, so he fought back. I don't know how to tell you this, Judy. That's why I didn't call. Uh, Tom's dead. That's sad. I like Tom. I was thinking of you. And before you ask, no, 
You weren't wearing clothes. Damn. I heard there was some trouble in Japan town at the parade. Uh, what did you, you hear? What'd you hear? Corpos opened fire. Civilians were killed. Totally yeah, was not that me. was kind of my fault. <laughs> Don't ask me how, but the second I heard, I knew you were involved. Just wanted to talk to Hanako. Things went a little sideways from there. Dealing with corpse? What did you expect? What else is going on besides that? Ah, uh, you know, same old. Rather hear where you've been up to. <sighs> I can get hugs and stuff. Ooh. Aw. I got a nice little hug. Ain't that cute? She looks confused almost. <laughs> and then give her a little smooching. If I wasn't always on the move, like you and I you. could spend more time together. Enjoy life. Quality over quantity, V. Just focus on tying up all your loose ends. Then you and I are leaving this city once and for all. Aw. Still want to leave? Still think about leaving Night City? Yeah. Someday. But as of right now, I've still got a reason to stay. You're welcome. I'll try. <sighs> try to. Helps to keep it at the back of my mind. Guarantee it does. People already say I've got a bounce in my step. Damn. Glad I have a good effect on you. Let's talk a little while longer. Let's talk for a little while longer. Before I have to delta somewhere. For you, I've got all day. I guess that's it. Morning should be good. Maybe the storm will finally pass. Everything looks like crap. So, are we ever gonna solve what the hell that uh, Cyber Psycho was humming about with River? And then she has the same hum? Oh. Oh. I guess she's showering. All right, let me not bother her. <laughs> yes. Damn, it's still bad out here. or something, I wonder? Right. Yeah, I wonder if it's something like that, like it's just glitched out. Alright, I guess we can do chipping in instead. level. Oh, which reminds me, we need to go to a ripper. Shit. That's right. Alright. Um, yeah, we hit 50 and 50 today, so... Where's Vic?
pretty sure that's big. Oh no, not dynamic. Service points. Okay, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's him. <sighs> Gotta show our loyalty to Vic. I think we've heard everything on this radio station, so... Pacific Dreams. Does he look like an adult version of the kid from Bully? <laughs> that's area hostile, but I have no idea why it would be. Checking them out? Nah, Chimamai needs to work. Oh yeah. Oh hey. Wanna, Wanna read my Daryl? Sure thing. Focus on the recent past and what you expect in the future. The chariot. You're ready for change. Ready to seek the truth about yourself. And to help, you'll have... someone from your family? The sun reversed. You'll meet some obstacles, but they will be temporary. So long as you follow your own judgment, stick to your chosen path. Strength. Strength of will, discipline, and courage will always be rewarded. But not necessarily at your destination, as the reversed magician shows. Perhaps the path itself is what's important, and will help you overcome your fear? Wanna read my tarot? Do another one. Sure thing. See if it's gonna be the same. <laughs> that one card. <laughs> the Hermit. In solitude, he discovers the truth about himself and the world. From this, he draws strength. His lantern cutting through the darkness. Could be you, or... Someone who shows you kindness? But watch out. A reversed Hierophant lurks in the darkness. He brings crisis, both in life and authority, Last rebellion one. and fanaticism. He is a grave threat. The devil reversed. You will find yourself under the influence of powerful people with unclear motives. Be very careful. The tower. You and everyone around you will experience a great shock. When the tower falls, nothing will be the same again. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it's the cherry bells hovering. I was wondering. 
morning. Thanks for the heads up, Misty. I'll watch out. I'm glad you understand. See if we can get some of those Muno sh shits shoved into me. I think it's these, anyways. All right, so I can do this one. I just can't do this one. Man, I wish I could take one point away from my other thing. I wonder if there's a way to do that. Use all incoming damage by 10%. Increases all resistances by 35. Uh, dang it. Just keep doing that. <sighs> I really just want better versions of everything I already have. Thanks, Vic. Double jump, so I wonder if there's extra stuff around. <laughs> Last time I was up here, it was like level two. <laughs> Hopefully be right after Vix. Oh shit. Thanks, Misty. What are you checking them out? Nah, Chuma Mine used to work here, that's all. Oh, yeah. When you get those kind of chews, I guess I put those out. It doesn't matter. It's literally been like three days of sandstorms. I didn't even mean to do that. <laughs> Might have went the wrong way. I thought this would just give me some altitude so I could jump over. Hey, finally. Next race practically in my backyard, which means 
I need to make sure folks around here know. I walk my talk. Uh, meet at the corner of Brandon and Wilson. Give me a call when you get there. Of course. It's good. I should solve the message. Your turn to take the wheel. Rogue should be here any minute. Right, just gonna talk to Rogue, right? Okay, one more time. Just gonna talk to Rogue about Smasher, right? Then you'll hand me the wheel, hop back in the passenger seat. That is the plan. Don't worry, I'll be gentle. You might even enjoy it. Actually, regretting this already. Okay, Strummer Guild, squeeze her for favors. Remind her all about how she left you to die in Sokka Tower. First, she was sure I was dead already. Second, I'd never do that to her. Don't have to. <laughs> Real quick, wasn't I saving a Johnny for this? Little situation. Eh, same diff. What? You gonna use your charm? Rogues never said no to me. Ever. Okay. Okay. Ready. I'm ready. About fucking time. Hmm. Look a little different. Fuss with your hair or. Fuck, it's good to be back. Never knew you'd gone off somewhere. What's your poison? Tequila. Tequila old fashioned. Top it up with beer and sprinkle in some chili. Silverhand special. Been a while since anyone ordered that. Kid me, I order one like every time I come. Give me another. You got it. You're paying for this, Johnny, from your dead ass bank accounts. <laughs> I'm glad I'm rich, Jesus. Cassie's writer. Cassie's writer. You mean anything to you? Mm-hmm. Tattoo guy. How do you know the name? We go back. Where will I find him? Got a salon in Watson, Pershing Street. So what'll it be? Billy Goat or the other one? The other, other one. one. She's gonna love it. <laughs> sure she will. Jeremiah Grayson. Heard he's an operator for Smasher. But you didn't hear that from me. Hey, who are you again? Yeah. Could say we had something in common. <laughs> Ruby Collins. Sloppy second for Grayson, after I banged her. I thought he was going to talk to Rogue. <laughs> it's the opposite of finding and talking to Rogue. I'm sorry. Hey! What the? Hey! Drink Slinger!
give it back. Simone! Simone! <laughs> Más rápido! <laughs> yeah. Simone! Simone! Direct. Loser. Left or right? Left. I think I got something better. Hey, you Ruby? What? You've heard about me? Let's get out of here. Tell you what I heard. Then you'll show me if I'm right. Just got a little biz to take care of first. Load. Yeah. Jonathan. Yo! Get your fucking balls off Ruby. She ain't going anywhere with you. She's on that clock. Got it? Yeah, best guys gotta work. So are you guys. Get back to work. I'm a crushed a bitch. Be waiting outside. You waiting for me? Let's go back to my place. Where to? Martin Street. But take the long way. Look good on you. Got a Thanks. light? Looks like we're starting to fade back to normal. You should probably look at the road. Oh my god! That's why I said ah! you should probably look at the road. Ah, I knew something bad was gonna happen as soon as she wouldn't take her eyes off of me. Oh fuck. Can we save her? Oh good. Fuck. We could have died. Ruby. Maybe I'll call. I'll call. Ruby, focus. I need to talk to Grayson. Yeah. Is that a condom? <laughs> it's gonna run out of pills. Hello, to keep the night city. V. Yo. <laughs> Spit blood first thing every morning. <sighs> Talk about something else, please. Sure. First time you walked up, since there was something familiar about you. Blah, blah, Johnny told you. Did we, you know. <laughs> Don't seem surprised. Don't seem surprised. Was surprised, but not anymore. You probably don't remember. Got flashes here and there. Not everything. Thank God. He called me early morning. Of course, I thought it was you. And I thought, cute kid. Too bad she's gone completely whacked. <sighs> Came to see for yourself, huh? Morbid curiosity. Mm-hmm. And I found Johnny Silverhand. Feels weird, this. Feels weird, this. You knowing about Johnny? Face is changing, you know. Still look like V, but that mean smirk, I'd know it anywhere. How he talks, moves, how he smokes. <laughs> I don't smoke. I know. Could never confuse you two. 
Yeah. So sleep soundly. He tell you about Smasher. He, he tell you about him? Yes. Didn't know he'd come back to NC. Johnny found some way to get at him. Wait. Grayson? Jeremiah Grayson. Works for Smasher. Johnny got a tip off some stripper, don't ask me how. Ebonike. Just that. Still, let me see what I can do. We're gonna get that son of a bitch. <laughs> she wants to help. Know what Smasher's been doing all this time? Know what Smasher's been up to all this time? Disappeared after the Sokka Tower assault in 2023. All thought he was gone for good. Then suddenly reappeared. Did a few Mondo jobs for Arasaka, then went right back to ground. Nobody's seen him in years. Except Grayson, apparently. Okay. Need some help? Can I help at all? In your state? <laughs> You're useless. Almost. Hollow buzz you when I learn something. Okay. Is this your pad, by the way? Unbelievable that bastard's somewhere in your head. I'm sorry. It makes you feel any better I didn't ask for this. you do to me <laughs> you ought to be the one puking here uh, you tricked me we were just supposed to talk to Rogue you ought to be the one puking right now yeah well life ain't fair sure picked the right moment to bolt out of my body ought to be happy I left it all actually for a moment there I thought for a moment there it seemed like you were thinking about Stan. I mean, such a good time. Don't trust me after all, huh? I know you thought about it. Saw it. I did exactly what we agreed. Let's get out of here. Mm. I was trying to show that I trust it more. Shit's hard, man. All right, so let's go do the race. The hell is this place? Place where you can puke all over the carpet, no problem. Beggar, not chooser. So, feeling better? No. Am I gonna get the answer? Jay walk to the right. Needs a chest. <laughs> the place is a bee. This game really needs brake lights. Like it's the it's such an easy fix. I feel like if AI slows or stops, brake light.
you know, just bring the brightness up of their uh, brakes by 10% or something. Sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna go visit Randy in the hospital. I wanna buy him a present. Got any tips? How should I know? He's not my nephew. Got a new record. Fresh tune. Cheer him up. Good thinking. How about you? How are you holding up? I'm alright. Question is how are you handling it? Uh, better when goes to arrive. Shit. Wrong button. <laughs> hey, where's my crap? Hey, that means I can wear Johnny's aviators. Let me see if they look good on me. I haven't worn aviators in a bit. You know what? I think we're going to go back to wearing the aviators. That's good. These are better than the ones that we started with. The other aviators kind of look like butt cheeks in comparison. <sighs> Alright, uh, what was I doing? Messages. River, river, river. Question is, how are you handling this? Been a roller coaster, so biz as usual. Managed on mine yet? Which beer are you on right now? Still haven't gotten around to it, but I promise I'll drink one for you. We should celebrate just you and me somewhere, chill, lay back. What do you think? Yeah, that way we can spend some time with him, but not trying to flirt, but I know we're flirting. I can say no to that. Ugh, I think it's about time I got to know the real River Ward. Sweet. Tell Randy I said hi. Of course, I will take care of yourself. All right. So we're not putting out the sexy vibes, just the friend vibes. time we're taking my ride. We've done two races in the truck, and the truck is kind of butt cheeks. I'm gonna show them that I am speed. <laughs> Josses for dinner. I'd love it if you swung by. What do you say? I thought you'd forgotten about me. Here I feared you'd forgotten about me. About you? Oh, come on, never. Just been swamped. It's been literally Randy's 24 hours. In the hospital. Someone has to keep an eye on the kids when Joss visits him. Relax. Don't need to explain. Right. So... Gonna stop by or gonna make me grovel? Sure, love to. Be great to see all you guys. Prime. 
Joss will be thrilled. Sure. Sounds great. He's got a crush on my you. sexy yeah. body. Please, hasn't been that Please, long. Please, it hasn't been that long since we last saw each other. Really oh, 24 hours. That's true, I guess. Anyway, you'll come by, right? I'll come by, River. Yeah, just stop See being so then. weird and drooly. Bro, I can feel you drool through the phone. <laughs> Is that what we sound like when we flirt with girls, like, and women, like, in real life? Do we literally sound like teenage boys, just like, hi, <laughs> you want to hang out? <laughs> They're so fucking weird. <laughs> see. Hello, yoo-hoo. Oh, Ron and Judy, booty, you're so cute, you know? Maybe just a little bit. Oh, when I said beer or booze. Pan Ams. Shit that came out way too formal. You know what I mean. Uh, thanks again for having my back lately. I feel like I'm just ranting and raging. So I just want to make sure you know that I appreciate what you did for me. Hey V, how are you? Everything okay? How you feeling? I hope you're getting somewhere with the bio that biochip thing. Just remember that you have friends uh that you have me let me know if things are going with you uh, hey things aren't easy but i'm getting by thanks for asking starting to run out of lot out of time which means less chance of getting through this listen saul and i have been thinking about how to get the family back on its feet we have a plan but it's the most important thing is that we might be able to help you. What kind of plan? Not another one of your plans. Not after last time. <laughs> yeah, what kind of plan? If everything goes according to plan, then, uh, well, let's just say the train heist has got nothing on this. Trust me. <laughs> God. Freaking psychopaths. I owe you one. Wide open road, dirt sand mountains. It ain't much, but it's still got beautiful things I've seen in my life. Thank you. If you ever need anything, you know where to find us. All right. Anyone else have like random messages? There you go, Lizzy Wizzy. About the job, I'm counting on your discretion, V. It's me. What do you want? I still don't think I got paid for that. Like it said it did. I still don't think it did. Hey yo, Claire. Claire. V. Are you ready? ready for the next race? Hell yeah. Ready here? Ready and waiting. You want to use your own ride or am I bringing Beast? My ride. We'll take my ride. Feels more natural to me. You get it. Of course. Yours it is. Meet there, yeah? Yeah, yours is dog shit. <laughs> Be right there. See you then. It's like you made it yourself. Which I'm pretty sure you did. Alright, have a good lurk, buddy. Alright. Let's see what we got. Punk asses. Hey, V. Gonna take a look stomped. under the hood before we start. See if all's okay. But stay close, just in case. All right. Good luck. Hey, what gives? He literally just said stay close, but you know. I guess they got nothing today. All right, race time. Talk to Claire. You feeling all right? Got no fear Not at all. Not worried. This will get you killed. What, today? The race? Why? Not asking about just today. Could be, though, or next one. One after that. Chew of mine got shocked and killed by a faulty toaster in her own kitchen. <laughs> so, you know, it is what it is. Case or Alice or Alice. <laughs> well, we'll be, we'll be. All right. How do you see our chances? Our chances? How do you see them? Well, it's gonna be tough to beat out Luigi. And he's got Margot riding Gunner today. Right. So, 
Girl loves popping flats, but don't get hung up on it. Let it mess with your head. Just focus on the route. Let me handle the entertainment. Sorry, you need a minute to kick the tires before we get moving. Sure. Are you trying to tune my uh, lovely caliber in here? The muckmobile needs no assistance. The muckmobile is awesome. I hate that I can't. Oh yeah, like that. Let's count it down. Three, two, one. Oh what shit, we're not. Luigi, after him. Okay. Bye. Cut it sharp. Oh my god. I have no control. What's happening? Oh my god. What the fuck was that? I literally can't do anything. Alright, it's not even worth it. Alright, let's just load. Fucking bullshit, dude. <laughs> it like did two super bounces. How the hell did I end up over a fence? <laughs> God damn, dude. <laughs> okay, get in the ride. Why are those two still outside the vehicle? Two, one. one up front, see him? Luigi, after him! Big turn coming, cut it sharp! Oh, there's like zero turn! Troll, troll, troll! It's like zero traction control right there for some reason. <laughs> You're smashing right there. Oh my god. It's pure chaos. Did I lose control? Like that didn't even make sense. Dare him to try. You back that lead. What the hell was that? I'm like bouncing off of either thing. little things that shouldn't let me bounce and then or like big things that like I don't know, I shouldn't even do that too. What the fuck? What? Like right there, what the hell? I tapped left and it's just like 90 degrees, gotcha.
You gotta be joking. Oh, wait, wait. We can win this beat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just gotta smoke these guys real quick. Like, why does it keep losing all control like that? I think that's just the race mode. It just likes to take your controls and fuck with you. Like some kind of way to, I don't know, keep it fair to the AI or some crap. Bumps in the road that don't exist. Watch our back. They're moving to pass. Yeah, sure. Share them to try. All right, we still won. But that was a pain in the v ass. And Claire. Yeah. First place, V. Oh my fucking god, we won. She's We're no finals bound. Yeah. Hell yeah. That's three don't wins. Don't stop yet, okay? Move up a bit further. What for? Need to talk. Something you should know. Okay. Sit down for a spell over there, okay? Wow. Quite the view. Yeah. Me and Dean. We like to come here. Mm-hmm. Wanted to tell me something? I mentioned Dean before. My husband, yeah? Yeah, yeah. The driver. Wheel deer heat, right? Sweetest man I ever knew. <laughs> we were friends before my gender transition. He brought daffodils to the hospital. It's a new beginnings, he said. Were you married long? Twelve years. Oh, nice. Dean used to laugh that for our 15th... Explains all the trans he finally talked me into my first implant. I was prepping some surprise. I don't see any implants on you. Mind if I ask why you don't sport any chrome? I love machines, V, I do. But I don't ever want to become one. Is that weird? A little, I guess, but it's fine. Dean, only person who could have convinced me to chrome up. But guess we'll never know if he'd have managed, huh? That's fine. So why tell me about Why him? tell me about Dean? I mean, I mean, why now? He died during a race last year. The yeah. final. Not your standard fatality, though. Like... What's the connection? This have something to do with our race? Sort of. Thing is, Dean was murdered. He was flatlined by a Corpo Eagle Weasel. Peter Sampson. Exceptional walking Oh, that rot. guy. Okay. See his name a lot. What happened to your husband exactly? What's the Corpo's deal? Doesn't really matter, it was only ever another adversary to me. But to Dean, Dean and Samson had a history going way back. Something happened between them? Dean never admitted anything, but yeah. Yeah, there was some kind of strife. Something personal to their rally rivalry. When Samson came first, Dean got hot and bothered. Okay. Tell about this Corpo. What's the Corpo's deal? Oh, wait. Doesn't really matter. Something happened to Dean never something. Alright, what happened to your husband? Your husband. Exactly? How'd he die exactly? We just powered into the final straight. Samson peeling up the tarmac ahead of us. Was clear we couldn't win, so Dean let up on the chew. And then that snake slammed on the brakes. Dean also had to. He lost control. But isn't that how this race works? You don't get it. Road was clear to the finish line. He so would have won. Way. It yeah. was premeditated. So there's more to this race. Right, so 
This isn't business as usual for you. This isn't about winning. Well, that's right. Fuck winning. I want Samson dead. And this your best plan for vengeance? Folks die on the track all the time. Won't seem unusual it's at clean. all. Clean. Another day at the races. After you. In line with the rules. I dig it. What if Samson's not racing this year? And if Samson doesn't show for the race, yeah, what sore then? winner more like. He'd never miss a chance to puff out his chest. He'll race. Circuit champ last year. No way he'll let that go. Not try to repeat. Yeah, no, that's what, no, because he, he's he was hitting his brakes to slow down because he already was like, all right, we lost. And the other dude slowed down and brake checked him. That feels like sore winter territory. You know what I mean? Where he was like, oh, let me just let it go. And then, yeah, like him losing control, though, is his own fault in a way. I don't know. Let's kill him anyways. <laughs> yeah. And me. Help. Guess you want my help to zero him. That's my opinion. Killing though, Samson matters more than taking first. Fuck yeah. You have to make a choice. I like American people, though. What can I say? Sorry I lied to you, V. But no, I'm still having fun. I just won't finish the race alive. My priority is winning. Sorry, Claire, but I can't help. So? Means a lot to you. This. We're going to win and we're going to kill. So, yeah. Let's bury the bastard. Thank you. You're this right, though. The caliber goes so fast that everyone important. that was behind me during the race were just <laughs> flopping all See around. See you for the final. <laughs> That's right. I'm surprised they didn't get exploded. Oh, I can't do both? I mean, I don't really care about winning. Do you get anything special for winning? Like, realistically? Wait, how'd your truck get here? Oh, yeah, I forgot you can actually call for your vehicles. Yeah, everyone who was chasing my caliber, and you just look back, and you see their cars all flopping around and just having a really rough time. <laughs> So we did the first chipping in. And he kept his word, like I said. I was pretty sure he was going to. All right, so let's go hang out with uh, uh, River for a bit. Oh, Grim. No, my friends. It's clear, open skies. But don't take it from me. Get out there and enjoy the sun. And we'll do the last race tomorrow along with uh, chipping in and all that stuff, depending on what goes on today. Oh, wait. Well, yeah, no, I could stream tomorrow. It, it just, I might start a little bit early. Like at 8 a.m. instead of the usual 10. That way I can still do four hours for y'all. Hell, we might actually beat the game tomorrow, depending. I don't know how long it is once you do the Hanukkah part, though, so I might have to put it off for like three days. Like, then I, I won't be streaming for the next couple days. Fuck. <laughs> oh, God. get anything good for winning panda or is it just it's better to just kill him it's fun so i'm here for the fun factor i don't really need things i got the best car in the game and that's you know thanks to you so if it's just like a car or something i really don't care how's it going feeling better i'm chatting with my people on it looks like we might have a lead on grayson everything's fine i'm ready for what's I'm ready. What's the play? Uh, sit tight for now. I need to comb through some intel, but it looks promising. All right, cool. Oh, and also Pan Am was talking to us about some stuff. So I'm not going to do her shenanigans. 
think if you win the race, it's just money and Claire gets mad at you. Okay, then yeah, it's not really worth it. Huh. I think it was here. Why can't I ever park where I want? Like, I'm trying to turn my vehicle around. Let me do it. You whore. Now it's too deep and it won't let me drive away, I think. Good enough. Chase the guy. There's uh, other dialogue options to win some cars, two different cars. Bro, my parking brake's not working. What the fuck? He's <laughs> just scooting along. <laughs> but seriously, what the hell? I tried jumping on it. Nope. I guess it's just gonna roll that way. Well, it ain't my trailer. Cool I don't think these are the kids, though. Right. I'll wait. Do it. At least that three day sandstorm ended finally. Sup, kid? Oh, hey! Hi! Sup? Hey, how's it going? Over here! I'll right, be there in a sec. Gotta talk to my boy. Not, Not coming. coming? Not really my jam, picnics. But you have fun. Spinning a new song anyway. Rather focus on that. Okay. Kinda, I kind of dig that. Glad you're here. I need your help cooking. Well, What's you on can't the menu? Stir a pot on your own. Jambalaya. Come on. You can stir the meat. Uh. That's Soy meat. Weird. Okay. Joss wouldn't be more help. Oh no, maybe Joss would be more help. Joss did her bit. Just grab the damn spoon and start stirring. All right, Johnny, sort of silver hand. <laughs> this is an ancient Ward family secret. Uh huh. Onions, paprika, thyme. Just need to mince some celery and garlic. But you stir, please. Stir. I'm stirring. I'm stirring. Bet my socks you've never had better jambalaya. How's Randy holding up? How's Randy holding up? He's looking for his old self. Physically, though, it'll be a long road before he's back to full health. And mentally, that was some experience. What Harris did to him, fucked as this might sound, might have helped the kid. Could be wrong, but feels like a clean break for him. Yeah, in a way, I do agree with that. I thought you were joking about cooking. Honestly, really. thought you were kidding about the cook-off. Or that Joss had sweat away in the kitchen while... Oh, Joss doesn't know the first thing about cooking. Um. Actually, I like to torture foodstuffs. <laughs> Haven't had many opportunities lately. It's strange. Different Somehow look different than usual today. Is that so? Yeah. Different meaning normal. <laughs> As if you got a good night's sleep. Hmm. You well, look like ass for wanted once. you to see this side of me too. Weird. Anyways, uh, Peter Pan, revenge, exactly. Don't mean to spoil a nice day, but I gotta ask, what about Peter Pan? You're asking if I killed him. We'll talk later, okay? Sure. sure. No pressure. It's just I, you know. I know. So, oh, I forgot to mention, my family I found out recently, we've had this grill for years. We, we don't really get to use it All too right. often. I think you've stirred enough. But we have grabbing um, the rice from a the flat kitchen. top for it. Yes, for, sir. So I can actually cook certain things like I love doing, um, like bacon wrap uh, hot dogs and you know all sorts of stuff. I'm so excited. I didn't know about it until like a couple months ago, and it's finally like the good time of the year to start doing that stuff. So I think I, this soonish, 
I want to like cook up a bunch of eggs and stuff and just make a solid breakfast. And maybe I'll take some pictures for uh, Discord. I always forget to when I cook. I make some good shit, but I always forget to take pictures. Just to like show it off and flex on y'all. <laughs> what do I do? Find rice in the kitchen. No, Randy's always been that way. But I'm sure this didn't help none. You know, his father was a difficult man too. That's exactly what I told him. Simulates the freshwater Money environment of Amazon Basin from the mid Nobody cares about these kids who don't exactly fit the mold. In those words, yeah. Wanted to tear my hair out every time I heard him. And when can I visit again? That's great. Because I really want to bring him something. He loves music, so... Sorry? No, I'll remember. Just tell me. Thanks so, so much. You've been wonderful. Huge help. Mm-hmm. Yes. Talk again soon. Didn't want to interrupt the call and be weird. Really hey, nice of River. you to come. Thanks for having me. Thanks for having me over. I should be thanking you. Looking good, Joss. Looking good, Joss. Really think so? Thanks. How's Randy? How's Randy? Still in the hospital. Still in shock. But he's making progress. Haven't had a chance to tell you just how grateful I am. It's over now. That's what matters. What matters is it's over now. I just don't know how to repay you. If Randy don't had... Don't owe me a thing, Joss. Thank you. River's out back. You know... He can't seem to stop gushing about you. Well, we're not together, so. Basmati, nice. Screw him. <laughs> oh, if I was gonna go after anybody in this house, it'd be you. <laughs> but no, maybe on a different playthrough, I'd go after River. Tomatoes in next. Now you can toss in the rice. Rice is in. Dry, like... Okay, now this has to bubble and brew. Oh, okay. patio. Didn't even really think about it. I haven't had jambalaya in a while. Like, that would be really good. Grab a chair and a beer or something else. It's nice out here. Yeah, seems all good. Like nothing bad ever happened. Tell me now, about Harris. I paid him a visit at the hospital. Uh -huh. He's still in a coma? Yep. In a strange slumber between life and death. An empty shell in a hospital bed. One shot to the head. Quick and clean. I had the same thought. Nah, that would be, be no so simple. easy. I pressed the gun to his head and remembered something. River. How my parents died. Now, oh, you sure you want to hear this? I don't really give a crap, man. What happened? What happened? Old man had a farm, like Harris's dad. But when business took a turn, well... Life got hard. My parents managed to open a small grocery. We lived on the floor above. A loud noise woke us one night. They wanted cash. Register was empty, so they stormed upstairs, forced us all to kneel, and demanded my dad tell him where he hid the money. You know, that's gone if you don't want to. River, you don't gotta go on. 
Heard sob stories enough? No, just... This is tough, I can tell. You really don't need to rehash it now. Okay, yeah. You're probably right. Just... Harris. What did you do? Had the gun to his head and... I've ended a few lives in my time. But never like that. Never an execution. Slipped out of the hospital quick. Told myself the case was closed. That's good. Good. But when now? You're not going back to the PD? P.I. has a nice ring to it. Ah, what see, else? I was right. Uncle was Trevor, like, you said you'd play with us. He really gives the P.I. You promised. All right, all right. Let's go. V, join us? What are we going to play, Uncle River? You'll see. You'll all see. Dorian, we're playing. Yeah, big trouble in Haywood. Yeah, yeah, Grab yeah, your yeah. set. Oh, I'm gonna mess you kids up. You have no idea. Trouble in Haywood. My cop? Yeah, I am. Well, what do you think? I always wanted to play something like this. Always wanted to try a game like Finally, this. Finally! A BD type oh, well. thing that I can nice actually do. There. This is no time to get distracted! We can't let that filth get away. Who? Oh, yeah, well, look kids. at you. V, allow me to introduce Captain Joan McLean and Lieutenant Henry Callahan. They're our precinct's best and brightest. Wouldn't want to get in their way. I always Damn. work alone. No exceptions. <laughs> Even for you. Oh, he kind of dresses yeah, like you. Me too. Almost, huh? I know the type. Oh, I've heard of cops like you. The lone wolf type. That's right. Thorns in their commander's side. Rebels who play by their own rules. I've been suspended one time, retired two times, and kicked <laughs> off the force three times. <laughs> I'm getting too old for this. But something always drags you back. The city needs me. I'm so happy. This is so great. What should I know about Got being... a crash course? Anything I ought to know? The entire city is sick with crime and corruption. Lawlessness rules the streets. Is that terrible? And we're strong? no saints either. Even the police are haunted by the sins of their past. But the city's without hope. No one else would ever dare face El Chamuco and Diablado. Oh, he's the worst. <laughs> But I know we can beat him. The city's most evilest mastermind ever. Okay. All right. Let's, start. let's get to it. All right. All we gotta do is track down El Chamuco in Diablado and take out his lackeys along the way. He'll pay for his crimes. <laughs> we'll play like two teams, us and the kids, but we work toward the same objective. The team with the best result wins. You not stand it. Hey, V, just go easy, okay? It's their favorite game. Sure. You don't understand how good I am at games. Oh, there he is! Get him! The city's mine! You'll never take her from me! <laughs> She's yeah, fast, but that. not fast enough to escape justice. <gasps> Watch out! It's his cronies! Take that! Good job, kid. Yeah. Don't get cocky. <laughs> Too slow. Too many donuts. Not done yet. Next round, next round. All right, I gotta start missing. It must be their rat infested hideouts. I could smell the moral decay from a mile off. Mm, quiet. Too quiet. It's a trap. Yeah, boy. Not half bad. <laughs> He's hit. He's hit. Good job, kids. Ah, behind us. Got you, bro. <gasps> He's hit. He's hit. Okay, that's all of them. But next time we gotta be faster. Yeah, sorry. Uh, you guys gotta actually hit something. <laughs> 
What do you know, sir? Good job, kid. Don't charge in there, Callahan. I can't afford to lose one of my best men. Don't worry about me. I like this. This is fun. This game needed more of this. <laughs> like shenanigans. I love straight shenanigans. Yeah, you do. River kind of sucks, if I'm being honest. Okay, I think we got them all. But it's yeah. not over yet. Got you back like a buck crack. Get all the ones on the left. On. You get the three on the right. Ambush. Okay, so now lunch is ready. Uh, Come on. We're almost done. Him. Oh, you'll get him next time. Oh, right, that good part. At least we beat the grown ups. We're the best. Yeah, you are. Thanks for letting them win. They had fun. No problem. They're great. Oh, they're great kids. It's no problem. So maybe I should have been liking to you too. To actually try to beat Hey, it. food's on the table. Sorry. My bad. So, was your game fun? Awesome! <laughs> we kicked their big butts. Yeah, they the did. bad guys. Huh? Oh, yeah, the bad guys too. <laughs> Time to see if this tastes as good as it smells. Unemployment's being good to you. You seem good. River's discovering the joys of family life. Yeah. That and police duty. Never a good mix. This here's a way to get some of those years back. I haven't seen him this what untroubled is in a while. I should say. What about you, V? You got a family? Or just relations? Like to have one someday, don't have one. Not sure I'm cut out for it. Used to think used to see family baggage. as baggage. Something that'd hold me back. You know, career first. Didn't do any better for not having one though. Well, you brought my family back to me, and I'm grateful. If you say so, Joss. And my brother likes you. Joss. Well, why hide it? I am it? taken. I don't know why it didn't let me say that. He probably, probably asked, asked you to say that himself, didn't he? Was. Wow. How did she know? Aw. Uh, Come on, Joss. Poor you little don't see guy. wedding bells in my future, surely? Why not? Who thinks me and Uncle River make a good couple? <laughs> that's nice. Well, that's decided. I'm Got sorry, bro. Officer needs backup. Come on, pull you out of this ambush. Aw, I was eating. No one ever lets me finish my food. Thanks, Joss. Yeah, thanks. I'm sorry, bro. I just really like Judy. Whew. Situation was getting dicey. That's what partners are for. You were about a hair's breadth away from having to look at photo albums. Yeah. <laughs> That's the worst. Oh, shit. I thought we were leaving. Here's 
Here we are. What are we looking at? A water tower. Oh, Great spot. That. Great for what? For, you know, the water views. Tower. The views. <laughs> right. This way. Oh, fuck. Gate stuck again. Gonna fix it one of these days. I got it. Let me give you a boost. Climb over, open it from the other side. I don't need a boost. I got double jumps. No need. Whoa. Okay, we like leaping. Yeah. Just. Okay. On our way. <laughs> I am a strong, independent woman. I don't need no bad, man actually. and or anybody. Unlikely to dazzle. Make a good first impression, though. I don't need no Certainly bot. no Corpo Plaza. No. But life's livable here. No worse places to raise kids. Brandy's problems with the law. Those didn't pop out of Why thin does it air. Keep dropping me? True. Seems to touch uh, the Randy shoes. takes after his old man. He'd find trouble in a nicer neighborhood, too. There it goes. Damn, suddenly I can sprint up the ladder. V? Apparently the worst city the between the Atlantic and the Pacific. Flicked pings to some contacts. But Grace I sure and do buzz love familiar this view. for a friend from the old Find days. It calming. He did some digging. Found something. Section of the docks that's maelstrom turf. Ebonike? So why are these docks called Ebonike? Pretty sure it's no, got nothing to do with some long dead mayor. Dead wrong, actually. It's not the docks. It's an old container ship named after the guy. Okay, so you found Grayson? So you found oh. Grayson? You really got an in with Smasher? Come see me. Afterlife. We'll talk. Okay. Hi, right, pretty lady. What were we saying? River, I wasn't paying attention. I do. Ah, that's all French. All right. It says the two, I'm guessing, fights or something. Okay, the shell, PRA. I don't know. Probably like people beating the shit out of each other in France. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways. Am I wearing a cowboy hat? My shadow is. <laughs> That's new. Normally my shadow looks normal. Oh, it's... Okay. That's bright. Oh, there we go. Can't see shit in those scrapers from here. Skyscrapers are in the way of the spot, too. Scrapers actually seem pretty majestic from out here. Not seeing what goes on inside. Memories? High stress, dirty backstabs, kind of pressure that gives you ulcers. Somehow, I just don't miss it. Got something for you. Oh, yeah? Is it good? Pistol? Your piece? Matter a long time. Too long. I've seen a lot of people lately. I think it's time she found a new one. Trigger guards from their six shooters. Don't know what to say. Just the... promise you won't blow your foot off. Oddly yeah. specific request. Josh is like a lot of them have been drunk. Uh, keeping this very spot. But not Which made this your special it. spot? Family landmark? Something of the kind. All right, V. You know why we're here, don't you? Say you do. Please, don't string me along. I've been not stringing you along the entire time, you prick. I have picked the friend option every time. Don't you act like I've been stringing you along. 
Uh, that a pickup line? That the pickup line you settled on? Because maybe heard three in my life that were worse. And just a little at that. Wouldn't mind hearing them. Yeah. Happy to oblige. All right. You swallow beautifully. You got two wishes left. I'll fuck you for free. So I'm at a bar, and this gonk taps me on the shoulder and says, Here I am, baby. You got two wishes left. What'd you <laughs> That's say? actually pretty good. Spoke my second wish. That he would fuck off. Was there a third? Mm-hmm. Wished him a speedy recovery. Broken arm. Merciful, I'd say. Uh, you swallow beautifully. Will you swallow? Beautiful. <laughs> I've actually heard that one in real life. This guy and I, sitting in a diner. Five minutes, he gapes at me. Not a word. Then, drops that bomb. Oof. And I'll fuck you I'll for free. I'll fuck you for free. <laughs> what? Got a contract. To pull info out of a gigolo in a tech mink fedora. It was weird. He was <clears throat> spilling. And then, he pulled that one out of his hat. A candid and generous proposal, V. You should have at least considered it. Okay, last like one was good. Men. You know, woman once told me I have sexy calves. That's <laughs> it? Just like her boyfriends. Before he lost his legs in the war. Yikes. Oh, no. She was right, though. I do have great calves. <laughs> I like you, but not like Listen, that. River. If you expect this to evolve somehow don't stand a chance do i <laughs> maybe we keep it at friends yeah I like girls sure i like judy all right she's my queen we can my still have a drink yeah something strong's sure to hit the spot now that i understand To friendship. To friendship. I miss being able to say to this. <laughs> to friendship. Got any more of that? Two bottles of whiskey and a case of beer ought to be enough. We'll see about that. Buckle uh, your liver in. Gonna be a long night and a longer morning. <laughs> Johnny has been uh, strengthening my liver pretty well these past couple days. <laughs> where the fuck am I? Oh, oh, where did I put that? All right. Guess we had a fun nap. Oh, colonizing the moon, and there's still no cure for hangovers. Well, at least we had fun yesterday. Yeah. Um, but now I gotta roll. Promised Joss I'd take her to see Randy. No rush either. Get your sea legs back. Take as much time as you need. You good to drive? You sure you're good to drive? <laughs> Please. Former NCPD. I'm a pro on Hangover Highway. I'll be fine. That's not a good thing. Apologize to Joss for me. Ah, uh, apologize to Joss for me. We kind of dined and dashed yesterday. And left puke all over the bathroom? Oh, shit. Oh, no. Did I? Oh. <laughs> Tell Randy I said Tell no. Randy, hey. Will do. See you later, V. See a ho. Wait, there's something in here. Huh. What's up, Joss? Morning. I hope. The generator. You remember. That's right, part. 
Need me to fix it now? Yeah, now. Then we go to the hospital. I'd rather have everything ready for when Randy gets back. What's up with the generator? I don't know, but electricity's out. Yeah. And then his room needs tidying. I'm supposed to do that. There we go, fix it. I know how it sounds. Oh, hey, where's my gun? Oh, okay. I forgot, because we had the light gun. But... Oh, and what I was saying earlier, yeah, uh, so I've seen a lot of people actually doing a mod sort of like this in real life with their weapons. Is there a way for me to... There. Just do this. Uh, where they cut the bottom bit of the trigger guard off, so they still keep the front but they took off the bottom. It's for like uh, shooting a little faster or some crap. I forgot what the deal was, but not quite my bag, but yeah. Oh, it's like a mix of tech and power pistol. Power revolver. Two mods and a muzzle and a scope slot. That's kind of cool. This one time, please. I guess it eventually rolled down the hill. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna stop right here. Oops, shit. Not what I meant to do. Well, anyways, we're going to stop right here. I hope you all had fun. I know I did. All right. We should be able to finish the game in the next, I don't know, two days or so. Or two streams, I should say. Uh, last stream of the week is tomorrow until Friday. So uh, look forward to that. Dad advice for today. Oh, shit. Dad advice is, remember, no matter what happened to you, you still have a worth. You will never be worthless. And shenanigans for the day. Criminal records are just Pokédex entries for people. Very true, very true. But yeah, that's going to be it for me. Have a wonderful evening. It's been Beard. Later.